going to hang around in Dragon's Reach here and wait for the stream to go live. At the end of last stream, I sat down in this chair, so let's uh, stand up now. <laughs> um, and let's have a look at uh, some of my weapons. I've got this cool axe that's on my hip here. Um, and uh, I have got a Falmer shield, which I should probably actually equip. All right, hello, hello chat. How's my audio sounding? <laughs> well, Talion, I tell you what. Because, <laughs> Talion, because uh, it was all your fault, uh, that's absolutely fine. Um, what I want you to do is uh, to do nothing. It doesn't matter. It's all right. Because let's, let's imagine that it was my fault and not your fault. Uh, you saved me an awful lot of problems. So it's all fine. I'd rather have the one problem and not the other. Right, let's equip the Falmer shield and then let's do some favoriting. Unfavorite that. Uh, favorite that. And then we'll go down and sell some sell some stuff. <laughs> Talion says he's not <laughs> He's not going to catch a Pokemon in our Discord server as a punishment. Well, you suggested it, man. I wouldn't have thought of that, but uh, I think that's probably a good idea. Artist in the air says, Hello, hello, I left my like already let me go back to work <laughs> okay fine <laughs> off you go back to work all right so we're running down here we're gonna go see what time is it it's currently 3 a.m so let's wait about four hours and uh, we can go to the shop now. Just stand there for four hours. Yeah, Taylor, I think you have to catch a Pokemon as punishment. I think you need to pick a pick a starter from the list I put up and um, get in there and grab one. Okay, so we're going to go in the shop and oh, why is it? Hang on, let's wait one more hour. Hello, Starchip. How are you doing? Welcome to the chat. We are on. The, what the hell? What time do you open up, man? There we go. Uh, we are on the third iteration of the live stream because Talian had two versions of it open, and we thought we had technical issues. Everything's for sale, my friend. Okay. Take a look. What have you got for sale? I want you to buy all my crap, please. Fishing boots, hat. Oh no, oh I just bought it, whoops. Oh no, I want you to buy my stuff. Okay, let's sell that. Let's sell this shield. Any potions I'm not gonna use, like literally not gonna use. I think there was a, a sneaky potion. Unless I, I'll sell the potions of the Berserker because I'm never gonna use a two-handed weapon. Uh, keep that. Uh, any misc. Centurion Dynamo Core, yep, that. Uh, Kaurus, Ch Ch Kaurus Ch Chitin, Glomo Cog, Glomo Gear. I'll keep all the gems and the ingots. That one. Map of the Dragon Burials. Orichalcum Ingot. Alright, so we're going to keep all of that. I might actually sell the Dwemer Metal. And then we're going to go back and talk to the companions. Where was it? Solid Dwemer metal, yeah, I don't see a need for that. Unless I was going to make like Dwemer back. armor. Now I could make a set of stuff for Lydia uh, and upgrade it, but I think I'm going to wait until that naturally becomes needed. Or I might end up with a different companion. And I also know that 
if I get to the end of the companion's quest and get the special boon that comes from it, I know that Lydia will not like me, so I'll have to get rid of her at that point anyway. So we're going to go into your Vaskir. The thumbnail for the stream for this should have uh, the long house in the background, uh, if I set it up correctly. There you Skior. are. You wanted to see me? I did. Your time, it seems, has come. What do you Last mean? Last week, a scholar came to us. He said he knew where we could find another fragment of Uthrad. Uthrad? He seemed a fool to me. But if he's right, the honor of the companions demands, demands that we seek it out. out. I'd be honored to it's retrieve it. It's a fine it. line between respect and bootlicking, new blood. We've decided this will be your trial. Do Farkas will be your shield sibling on this venture. He'll okay. answer, try not so to I've got Farkas. Or to get him killed. Right, speak to Farkas. Uh, looks like I've got a level up. What should I put it into? Hi Sam, are you backgrounding me while you attend your ADHD talk? Hey Python, how you doing? Alright. Uh, let's level up my stamina. Uh, I want to see if I can get that shield bash. So let's have a look at... Is it block? Uh, block, here we go. Shield wall, power bash, requires 30. Okay, interesting. That requires 30. I might hang on to my perk and... Lashing does five times more damage. Yeah, I might hang on to my perk and when I level up my block by blocking, I'll uh, go and spend it on that. All right, let's go find Farkas. Where is he? Over here. Python, I'm very well. Um, we had some technical issues at the beginning of the stream, so we've restarted again 10 minutes later. Um, the technical issues were a member of well, my Discord community had two versions of the window running. Today's been a good day, went out for a nice walk with Sam yourself. and had a nice dinner with gravy. You're going to be my shield, so brother? Told. Let's see if you impress. How are you, Python? I'll what have you been up to today? Right, we've lost Lydia. Uh... Can you train me to better use heavy armor? I'll show you what I can about protecting yourself. Yes, please. Right, how do I... I've got a thousand gold. So let's train a level in heavy armor. And let's train another level. Sick. Okay. Why did school call this my trial? Sure you're honorable. If you are honorable and strong, then I can call you brother. Call me brother. What is Wuthrad when it's your home? Who started the companions. Wuthrad. He came from the ancient homeland. But not all of them, because some of them are still here. Who was this scholar? A smart man came and told us about Skior thinks you should find it. And okay. I'm supposed to so the upshot here is there's a piece of this mythical weapon called Wuthrad, and I'm going to go retrieve Don't delay, it. delay, shield brother. Come on, Farkas. We're going to wherever the heck that was. So Python's uh, day was full of chill streams and mod research uh, with, if, with your family altogether. When you say mod research, what's mod research? Like video game mods or something else? Am I just too gamified to think of anything else but games? Here we are running through beautiful white run. The cultists that we defeated are still on the floor. I guess they'll just be there forever now. Is that, is that how that goes? If they stay there forever, I could just use them to store stuff in. A nip in the air. Roxanne, hello, how you doing? <laughs> Welcome back to the Skyrim stream. Uh, yesterday, what you missed, Roxanne, was we finished um, the first of the Companions quest. I got myself a very cool axe and a new shield. Uh, you can't quite see it if I if I have it here. And uh, we fought a hell of a hard boss. There's some level 20 Falmer guy with a Centurion. And then we came back and made a bunch of potions. Okay, let's have a look at the map. And we are going to go over to Dustman's Cairn. 
Uh, I'm not even going to bother fast travelling. I'll just, I'll just run. I'll just run over there. Whoop, 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 whoop. I did mean to make myself a new helmet at the forge, but I think the fact that I completely forgot means that I should be wearing this one. Python's telling me that those cultist bodies are going to stay there forever. So I could essentially use them as like a house. You know, you said I could get a house and have a chest to store things in. Could I not just use a dead body and just store all my stuff on the dead body? Uh, star chip. You cannot, you cannot sing the lyrics to that song. So Starship in the chat thinks it's very original to type out the lyrics to Roxanne by the police, as if Roxanne's never heard that before. I didn't think you had. What are you, like a similar age to me, Rox? Yeah, of course you are. Yeah, we went to college together. So yeah, I'm sure you I'm sure you never heard that before. <gasps> bunny! Bunny, 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 bunny! Bunny, 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 bunny! Okay, anyway, right, I got distracted by the bunny. <laughs> Starship, I think as penance, I think you need to uh, be the person that explains to Talion how to, con how to um, catch a Pokemon in the Discord server. That's what you should do. Or you should uh, tell us your real name so that we can apply song lyrics to it. I caught a bee. Starship is a fellow content creator. He released uh, a video today on the amazing card survival game Stacklands that I've also done a series on. And it's very interesting watching him struggle to beat the uh, DLC world, the world of greed. That's a tough world. Hello, King Blocked. How are you doing? It's a doggy dog world out there. Well, I kind of know what happens at the end of the companion, so I thought uh, a little hint like that would be quite a cool little title for the live stream. Okay, let's, uh, in true King Block fashion, now that he's here, let's uh, click save. Oh, King Block, I actually have assumed your gender there. I don't know if you are male, female, or other, but uh, please correct me if I'm wrong. Dustman's Cairn discovered. So, Roxanne, did you go play Skyrim after you left the stream yesterday? Go into Dustman's Cairn. Starship says his real name is Dutch and Exotic. I won't be able to apply song lyrics to it. Is that because no one writes songs about Dutch people? Ooh, that's me being xenophobic right there. I apologise to Holland. I really like your uh, like national colours. Bright orange is actually my favourite colour. I was in... Tread lightly. I was in Amsterdam, actually, for some... Some event. I wasn't there for the event. I happened to be there, staying there, and there was some like major football tournament where all of the people uh, wearing all the football kit were like out in the street, and it was just a sea of orange. We're going to read the Battle of Sancretor. The Battle of Sancretor was very, very long. Lots of pages, lots of words. Here they are. If you're watching this on catch up, you can pause and read that yourself. If somebody wants to give me the upshot of what that is, they're more than welcome to. So I've got my cup of decaffeinated tea here and some Viennese wells and a bottle of water. Um, so I feel pretty, pretty cleared out. These guys are all already dead. What the heck? Be careful around the burial stones. I don't want to haul you back to the Orbasker on my back. Have we already been in here? Oh no, there's, some, there's something moving. Hello. Bosh. <laughs> Got him. I also stole his soul. I don't want the mace. Let's drop that. Uh, ancient Lord Mace, drop. Lucky hit. So King is saying that your workplace misidentifies you as a paperwork machine, uh, but otherwise you're a dude. <laughs> okay. I think you. I think we might have established that. It's sometimes so difficult on uh, online to tell someone's gender or whatever. Oh! 
Most people are cool if you... As long as you get it right after you've been told, I think that's the main thing. Nice. Bone meal gold. Uh, let's uh, heal up. Now, Sam told me yesterday that if I heal on both hands, I can do it faster. Which is uh, a cool trick. And then let's uh, put the farmer shield. Where's, what weapon was I using? Steel mace. Oh, I haven't. Right, uh, yeah, I haven't uh, favorited that. So let's favorite that. My. <laughs> My weapon is called Baron Von Trappington because I put Soul Trap on it. Uh, where are you? There we go, right at the top. Cool. So where do I come in? Let's go this way. Here, aha, right, no, that is not the way. Up here. Roxanne's advice yesterday to use the map has just been like absolutely game changing for this game for me. <laughs> the amount of times I've just wandered around. Hello again. <clears throat> Best stream ever. I just spilt an entire cup of tea all over myself and all over my laptop, <laughs> all over the coffee table and all over the floor. Um, <laughs> I've just tried it up. Um, where it says in the chat with just like random symbols, that's where the tea went all over the laptop. <laughs> and I just cleaned it off with a a tea towel and it seems fine okay here we go so King says no it was not hot the tea was not hot uh, it was at the, the I'd left it for ages because I was chatting away on here so King says here's the thing about enchantments armour and jewellery are passive weapons are active it means you eventually need to recharge them with soul gems in the inventory okay I'll bear that in mind If I enchant my armor and like rings and stuff, that just stays there and never have to recharge it. But with weapons, I'll have to put a new soul gem on them at some point, yeah? Is there a way to deactivate the charm? Hello, Mike. Mike Oxlong. I'm using a chitin axe thing because this weapon was what I got from the boss at the end of the last stream last night. And it was hard won from a level 20 Falmer. It's more, more powerful than what I had. So uh, I decided I wanted to use it. I've also got his shield, which I nicked. It just felt appropriate, you know, to jump in there and nick all his stuff. Let's take these potions, bone meal. Uh, oh, leather strips. You think leather strips in here would be pretty worn, worn out by now? An enchanting table. Oh. Why don't I see if I can enchant my armor? Right here, funnily enough. So enchantment, uh, soul trap, fortify archery, fortify heavy armor. Should I do fortify heavy armor on the armor? Uh, steel armor, soul gem. Filled with lesser soul, filled with grand soul. Craft. Sweet. Uh, and then uh, I will fortify my gauntlets. 
with fortify. I really want fortify um, flipping. What's the word for it? The green stuff, not charisma. What's it called? <laughs> Stamina, that's it. That's it. Wow, I can't believe I forgot the word stamina. Okay, so I want to go... Is this the way I came down? Yeah, it is. Stam, yeah, fortify my stam. Hopefully I'll find something that lets me do that soon. Aha, here's a lever. Activate lever. I'm trapped. This lever is stuck. Okay. Now look what you've gotten yourself into. No worries, just sit tight. I'll find the release. What was that? It's hey, a bunch gone. of dudes. Mistake, companion. Which one is that? Doesn't matter. He wears that armor, dies. Killing you will make for an excellent story. Uh, the silver hand, you eh? You'll be alive to tell it. Bruh! Haha. <laughs> woof, woof! It's like. It's like flipping Twilight here. See it, rip him apart, Farkas. Oh, I can't wait to finish this quest line. <laughs> right, let's loot these idiots. Potion of Cure Disease. Nice. Thank you, Carcass. I didn't scare you. It's Jacob, yeah. It's, <laughs> it's a blessing given to some of us. We can be like wild beasts. Fearsome. You're going to make oh, me no. a werewolf? Only the circle ha- I... We should keep moving. Still the Draugr to worry about. I'm not too worried about the Draugr, not with you around. Okay, let's loot these guys. Cure disease, nice. And then, mosey on. So maybe I won't pull that lever. To wait, right? So we look at the map. Right, yeah, down here. Activate lever. This lever stuck as well. Aha! I suppose that's the one he used to save me. Let's quick save there because of that event. Huh? <laughs> Mike says I should watch Vampires Suck. They make him a chihuahua. Is that like some sort of comedy show? Okay, blocks increased to 29. I just need to get it to 30 to spend that perk. I really want that shield bash. Stop killing all my dudes. I want him to attack me. Come on, attack me, idiot. I'll tear you to pieces. Come back. Oh, he is actually got a fair bit of health. There we go. I've got soul trap on the axe, but I haven't actually uh, like got any soul uh, soul gems anymore. Charred skiver hide. You're back up. Good. All his stuff is trash. Go 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 Imp store. Oh, we need to eat that immediately. Ingredients. Imp store. Oh, so Mike's saying that apparently Vampire Suck is a Twilight parody film. Oh, I've never heard of it. It sounds really funny. Sounds really stupid. Anything that takes the Mickey out of stuff that's so serious is is fine by me. All right, let's carry on down. Skyrim, ba 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 ba. Skyrim, what's through here? Hello. Hmm, interesting. 
Uh, hello, I'm looking for the piece of Wuthrad. Anybody, anybody got one? Wuthrad. Silver hand. So who are these silver hand guys then? Am I, I guess I'm not supposed to know. Sure I will. Oh, that guy keeps getting in my way. Okay, let's uh, run back here and pop on some healing. Okay, so Sam in the chat is saying... Sam in the chat. <laughs> Sam in the chat is my girlfriend, for anyone who doesn't know. Um, is saying that I will find out who the Silver Hand are. I mean, Silver, Werewolves, I'm guessing they don't like Werewolves. It's kind of their deal. Come here. Come here and attack me. I want to level up my block. There we go. Okay, I need to eat a potion. Draft of health. Uh, no, I want a potion of healing. I've actually hardly got any because of that fight from last time. All right. Gold and a bunch of garbage. I suppose when you play this on PC, you've got hotkeys, right? And <laughs> you'd have to like keep going in that menu to get stuff. I'll rip you in half. Okay, so King's telling me to go and talk to Farcast to find out what's going on, and Sam's telling me to take the silver silver weapons. Okay, I can do that. I'll go back and find the other guys' weapons as well. Oh, do you know what? No, I won't. I'll, uh, I'll leave that for now. There's my weapon. There we go. Smoke. Oh, so apparently we were being attacked. Thanks, chat. I didn't realise that. Here we go. I'll talk to Farkas after we've after we've uh, dealt with this silver hand person. Hey. Bash. Cool. I really should have bought some empty soul gems off of Farangar. I think that would have been a good idea. Uh, silver sword. Okay, I'll grab that. Farkas, you need healing, mate. We should keep moving. Who are the silver hands? Bad people who don't like werewolves. Bad people who don't like werewolves. So they don't like us either. Okay. Not everyone, but all the circle are. So the circle are, are all everybody. werewolves. But he's just mm -hmm. had to show me in order to save himself. Eat the food and ingredients. I... Yeah, I should have... Yeah, I was, I was, I was. Uh, and I've got all the ingredients I've been eating them whenever I get a new one. Yeah, I did that. Maybe I missed one or two. I will concede maybe I missed one or two. Okay. Go, 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 go. Oh, okay. So he had mud crab chitin on him. Let's eat that. Yeah, Nom. Restore stamina. Oh, yeah. That's what I want. Thanks, Sam. I didn't actually spot that for some reason in the uh, in the menu. Okay. I think it's a good place to do a quick save. Lovely stuff. Dude. Okay, 
Uh, did he kill me? What? I didn't even spot that happening. Okay. I will get my weapons up beforehand this time. These fights were a little tough. Stun. Stun. Block increase to 31. Um, sorry, mate, but I need to quickly level up in the middle of this fight. Uh, so let's uh, level up the health. And then I want to get that shield bash, power bash perk. Reflect arrows. And what's this one? Quick reflexes. Time slows down if you're blocking during an enemy's power attack. That's pretty good. Uh, I think uh, I might actually go for this quick reflexes one. That literally might save me in this fight. <laughs> right, let's run away from here. I need to heal. Ah! Healing, healing, healing. Boom, boom. Oh, come on, Farkas. Let me get the kill. Let me get the kill. I should rename my shield so that um, I can find it <laughs> properly. Did you kill him? There we go. Drago's dead. Soul trap. Uh, this guy's probably got a silver sword then. Silver great sword. I guess those things are heavy, right? They probably are. Let's quick save there. So, um, yeah, if you're new to my channel, hello, welcome. My name's Adam Pucky. I'm covering Skyrim at the moment. We're doing live streams. Um, I have played the game before, but not for very long. Um, and this is my attempt at running all the way through it uh, properly and doing doing loads of stuff and, and not getting overwhelmed by all the quests. Um, I do videos. I do Slay the Spire videos. I do learning to make video game videos. And I am intending to stream Baldur's Gate 3 at some point, which I was supposed to do tonight, but I've got the Skyrim bug. You know? Oh! So I decided to come back onto Skyrim. Um, and here we are. Mucking about with lockpicks. Oh, come on! <laughs> oh, that... I'm sure I had that then. Right. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Daily Nasses, I'm still struggling with lockpicking. Yeah, I haven't sunk any perks into it or anything like that. So I'm just like doing it brute force style. Zero encryption. Oh, silver ring. Take that. Okay. I'm actually going to quick save because I did that lockpick. <laughs> Someone is there, mate. Are these silver hand guys just hanging around in here? They're just hanging around. I don't actually know how to use my power bash. I need to run away. One at a time, mate. One at a time. Okay, I need to... Eat a potion before he hits me. I have no healing potions left. Okay. Are they all dead? Did you kill everyone, Farkas? He's uh he's pretty solid, isn't he? Hello, evil Satan baby from hell, how you doing? Uh, King says, uh, holding a torch before lockpicking makes it slightly easier. Okay, I don't know if I have a torch, but um, let's have a look in my inventory. Where would I find torch? Miscellaneous? Yeah, i got two of them. Alright, well if I get to another locked thing, I'll grab a torch and uh, try that. 
unless you're winding me up and it's like something that will instantly kill me which I'm not I, I'm not ruling out All right how do I actually use my power bash able to do a power bash Oh, so Satan Baby's just got back from working out. What day was it today? Was it leg day, arm day, back day, face day? What was that? Whoa. Yeah. Do you eat mine? Silver sword. My carry weight is getting pretty high, so I'm going to stop collecting swords now. Sorry, Farkas, I knocked you off your feet. Uh, let's uh, heal up here. Keep the pillar in between me and the silver hand guy. Here we go. Alright, come here. Time to die. Got him. Got him. Face day, smile training. Yeah. For power bash, hold the attack button while your shield guard is up. Okay, let's try it. Oh, okay. It, it isn't as dramatic as I was, uh, as I was uh, expecting. Come on, Farkas. We're going to the next section. King, I'm taking your advice and saving often. After, every time I have an encounter, I'm saving. Found you. He, de de you just one shot at him. Hawk feathers. Cure disease discovered from hawk feathers. All right. So just one guy just waiting in here for us. I can take it. Something going on down there. Is they hanging around? And I guess like the zombies are going to attack them. Barkas, why are you looking at me like that? Barkas, turn around. Watch where you're walking. I'll fix you good. <laughs> yes, Sam, I shoved loads of feathers in my mouth. So, uh, Evil Satan, baby, you do your, ca your calisthenics. Do you do the upside down standing on your hands uh, press up? That's my favourite calisthenic exercise because it hurts so much. I'm dead. Oh, man. Okay, we'll try that again. Yes, handstands. That's the word I was looking for, uh, Satan Baby. Down you go. So, silver hand, right. I thought I quick saved before I went through this door, but I must be wrong. There we go. So you do, so Satan Baby, you do like isometric exercise, isometric exercises. I know what isometric means, it's kind of like a diagonal top-down view. How does that apply to exercising? I'm curious. Right, these people. Uh, Okay, I need to run away. Run away! Barkas, get down there and do some work, man. Uh, where is my healing? Boom, boom. Right. Barkas will probably finish that lot off, right? He doesn't need my help. Trappington. Farmer shield. Let's go! Silver gold. Silver hand. Silver hand. Where's Farkas? 
Where are you, man? Alright. We dispatched them. There's one more. He's got arrows. Oh, I don't have enough magicka. Okay. Okay, right. Back to the shield. Let's dispatch this last guy and then we'll save again. Bro, stop blocking. There we go, we got him. Okay. Woo! Gold. Uh, I'm happy without everything else. Gold off of you. Gold off of you. Songs of the Return, Volume 56, Vampire Dust. Let's quickly read that book. Songs of the Return. Oh, it doesn't give me any powers. So I'm getting a detailed breakdown of uh, the complexities of calisthenic exercises in the chat. Um. <laughs> Going for a functional musculature rather than just looks, says Satan Baby. No, I know what you mean. I feel the same way. Um, I uh, finally have my own body weight at a point that I like it, and I'm certainly not looking like Wolverine, you know? I'm a bit heavier and stuff, and, and, I, and I much prefer it. I feel healthier, more upbeat, more energy. Um, I think that's kind of the way things are going now uh, with physical fitness. It's prioritising health over... You know, over a certain look, a certain style. And I think that's good. It's good to be putting the humans first instead of like weird uh, beauty ideals. Wow, this got deep very quickly. Uh, let's quick save here and have a little looky roundy. Map. Interesting. Okay. Burial urn. What's through here then? Uh oh, it's a, okay. So it's another um, lock. Let's uh, get that torch that you told me about. Equip that to my left hand and unlock. About here. Got it. The torch seems to do nothing. Okay, so King says that apparently uh, books, it's easy to identify books that give you skill stuff because they're worth a lot of money when you look at them in the inventory, which uh, makes sense. I don't want an embalming tool, thank you very much. Yeah, that makes sense to me. I'll watch out for that then next time um, I'm picking up books and, and looking at them. Uh, ah, interesting. I feel like something's going to jump out at me here. Dustman's Cairn Key, Gold, Soul Gem, Lockpick, Bonanza. A dead Draugr. This suggests to me that the Silver Hand have already been here. Steel ingot. What's that? Leather strips? Yep. Nice. So Evil Satan Baby from Hell says he's getting rid of for the release of Fallout 5 IRL. Hey man, with some of the stuff going on in the world at the moment, you're not <laughs> you've probably got the drop on quite a few of us there. Here we go. What's this? A skeever? Got its soul. Did I want to, did I want a Steve Soul? Darn it, nice. More speeders. 
Wow, I, I didn't know I had this many soul gems. Okay, so apparently the thing with the torch is, unless I have a mod installed, the torch does nothing for lock picking but role playing for light. Um, it's supposed to make the lock pick angle wider, but we don't have a lock pick angle interface to confirm that. Uh, and then Saint Baby says, "Yeah, hope for the best. Be prepared for the worst with the old uh, with the old prepping, the old working out prep. You need to uh, work on your oh alchemy. Uh, you need to work on your like." Improvised weapon skills. Can it use this while in combat? Maybe I'll come back and kill whatever's in here and come back. Skeevers! I think, uh, as companions go, so far I'm not that impressed with Farcast. I think that Lydia was just like more more into it, more willing to like dive in there and tank, because I don't even know where Farcast has gone. Oh, Python, do you have to head off? Evil Satan Baby says that he has firearms. Wow! Like the human torch. Frostbite spider. Down you go. Trap the soul piece. Cool. So with soul gems, because I didn't think I had that many, but I seem to be capturing souls like crazy. Uh, oh no, I have got loads. Yeah. Okay, I must have been picking them up off of those, off of those people. So the question I was about to ask is moot, because I, I thought maybe, I was going to ask if it stacks multiple souls into one gem, or something like that, but clearly it doesn't. Right, let's run back to that enchant enchanting table. Here it is. Uh, damage health. Got no restore health stuff. Uh, so let's just make. Damage stamina. Damage health. Uh, fortify conjuration. Uh, ravage stamina. And then restore stamina. That's This is one I actually want. Cool, and I think I got a level up. Okie dokie, right. Let's go into level up. Magicka, health, stamina. I think I will actually upgrade my stamina. A bit more. Well fitted. 25% armor bonus if wearing all heavy armor. <laughs> Head, chest, hands and feet. Unarmed attack. Uh, and... Well, I am wearing all heavy armor, so let's... Uh... Actually, I think I might actually, 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 actually go into my one-handed fighting, because that's not that developed. Jewel flurry I don't need. Fighting stance. Critical charge. Savage strike. Uh, let's do one-handed weapons, do 60% more damage. There we go. Right, I feel like we're kitted out. Okay, so King's saying that the best souls come from human enemies, but we got a better expert on souls in the chat. <laughs> uh, Satan Baby 
you've got a whole bunch of weapons, eh? I, I don't own weapons. In uh, in the UK, weapons and stuff are just illegal. Like, nobody's got anything like that apart from, like, farmers. Farmers and people who are responsible for, like, you know, like, land rangers and stuff like that. Estate rangers, uh, people who cull deers, that sort of stuff. Uh, cull uh, deer, sorry, not deers. Uh, but yeah, otherwise, that nobody owns firearms. Okay, I need to run away. Does anyone know, anyone in the chat who's watching, know where Farkas might be? <laughs> Is he just like on his knees somewhere? Uh, steel. Alright, we're going to run back, we're going to take this guy out. Hello. Pow. Pow. Got him. Good job. Gold. Uh, nothing else of use. I'm guessing I maybe have to go through a door and Farkas will like teleport back to me because he must be trapped somewhere. Restless Draugr. <laughs> right. Let's. Let's forge ahead. If I if I don't get to a proper door, I will I guess I'll go back for him. I'd rather not I'd rather not do that if I can help it. Thank you. Gold, Mr. Draugr. And for yours, thank you. Very obliging, these Draugr. Open iron door. This looks like somewhere where a fight is going to happen. So let's uh, get my conjure familiar out. Hello? I hear funny music. Word of power. Fire, fire breath. Fire! Yes! We got soul gems. All without Farkas's help. He did nothing in the end. Well, he did help us get here. We're completely safe. Oh no! Evil Satan baby says, here they come. Here they come indeed. Weak poison. There's a few here. Hey! Bosh, what do you want? Die! And one of them seems to have gotten stuck, which is good. I can get some of my stamina back before I fight him. It's just stuck behind there. Hello? What are you doing there, mate? You alright? I mean, I could just run. I don't actually have to fight them all. Oh, my power attack did not work. You're dead. Go on, hit me. Hit me in the shield. Come on, look down you go, son. And you. Line up, line up, line up. <laughs> There's another one behind him. They're all queuing up. My familiar uh, did nothing. Oh, maybe it disappeared. Here you go. Hit me in the shield. Bosh. Cool. Good work. Thanks for the warning, Satan, baby. It was uh, slightly too late, maybe. But there we go. Potion of Strength, Gold Ring. Lovely. Let's loot these bad boys. 
There's a few up here as well. Give me all your stuff. Another one. Another one. I'm just gonna keep coming. Okay, I think I'm gonna run. Let's run. Uh, healing. Interesting. It'd be cool if you could do a double shield build on this. And uh, maybe a disarm move would be useful to Oh, I've got no stamina. Come on, mate. You're down. There we go. Run away. I've oh, got no. I've oh, got no stamina. Oh man, okay, uh, I need to uh, heal. Listen, in it. Can I get out of this door? Requires key. Uh, oh my god, there's a lot of them. Ah! Okay, I need to not be here, I need to be up the top of the stairs. That's that's where I need to be. Let's regroup. Uh, let's take a, a few potions here. Potion of fortify health. Potion of poison. Cool, that's one. Hit the shield. Back, wash, fish, wash, back. Uh, we'll go for some healing. I've got no magic. This is stressful. This is very stressful. All right. I want, I just want a piece of wolf rad. Is that too much to ask? Oh, that's another one. Another one, another one, another one. Potion of water breathing. Oh, it's one of these got a key. Is one of these dead guys going to be carrying a key? Uh, I need to run, I need to run, I need to run. Oh my gosh. Uh, healing, healing, healing. Move, 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 move. This would be a lot easier if I had my companion with me. Ah! Oh my gosh. Uh... Chess. The bow of fear. Uh, I'll take that to disenchant it. Staff of fury, and then we'll ditch some heavy stuff. Let's ditch these elven gauntlets. And one found the shield. Where's the key? Oh, this is painful. Through here. Okay. Whew.
Wow, well, we survived that. I probably hey. end up staying in there a lot longer than I needed to, hey? My God. Huh? Oh, there you are. Hello. Thanks for all your help. All right, okay. Um, we're going to... <laughs> we're going to save there. <laughs> and I'm just going to quickly uh, grab some water and I'll be right back. Wowzers, okay, we're back. Uh, we need to go to here. So let's uh, fast travel to Dragon's Reach. We'll go and turn in the quest. I think I'd like to file a complaint Damn, about uh, Farkas, to be honest. They want to back the storm cloaks. He wasn't quite holding his weight, in my opinion. Harvest stuff, I'm gonna to wanna to make a whole bunch of new whole bunch more potions. Your Vaskir. Alright, let's go talk to this fella. Brothers and sisters of the circle. Today, we welcome a new soul into our mortal fold. This man has endured... I sure have, without much help from you guys, thank you very man. much. Who will speak for him? I stand witness to the courage of the soul before us. Would you raise your shield in his defense? I would stand at his back, that the world might never overtake This guy doesn't realize that Farkas doesn't fight with a shield. It stands ready and you didn't bear witness to much, mate. Folks. You were off outside and somewhere. And would you raise a mug in his name? I would lead the song of triumph as our mead hall reveled in his stories. Then the judgment of this circle is complete. His heart beats with fury and courage that have united the companions since the days of the distant green summers. Let it beat with ours that the mountains may echo and our enemies may tremble at the call. It, it, shall, shall, be so. So. it shall be so. Well, boy, you're one of us now. I trust you won't disappoint. I won't. I will not disappoint. All right. So we've got a whole bunch of different leaders to pick from, uh, which is pretty cool. Says that I, have the strength of these I think I will... There's nothing wrong with Go sleep in a bed. Oh, I could have used my berserker power, and I forgot about my dragon shouts in that fight. To the old Mary <laughs> they us God all. damn it! Let's 
go sleep in the bed. It's 2.29 a.m., so we'll sleep till uh, 8.30. Well, although that was a bit stressful, I do feel a certain sense of achievement at having survived that. So that's good. I've been tending to the warriors of your Vasker for as long so as So we've got uh, Farkas for another quest. I have the strength of Isgrimor, and my brother has his smarts. Vilkas is Come asleep. Come to me with questions. I know our history almost as well as Vignar by now. Except I can remember it. Is he the one who trained you in heavy armor? What brings you to me? Find some weapons. strange oh, okay. creature in your travels? I've heard some rumors about you and Skior. And if you want to keep having ear... You still need to prove yourself. Are you looking for help with something? This is a busy uh... time. Forbidden, but even so, it's not true. So that's that. Yeah, I think I've heard Farkas you is may actually be stronger than you look. Don't want archery. Perhaps I'm still trying to figure out why Skior let you... Uh, okay, let's, uh... I see everything. Go find Farkas, see everything. if we can... I really want to train in one-handed weapons, actually, oh, I'm a rather than more secrets. armor. Have to be in this hall. Draga dungeons. King says Draga dungeons usually have a gimmick. Ustengrav is one of the longer battle ones. Rough stuff. Good job. All these younglings scampering around. Worried one of them. All right, King. See you later. Advice. Thanks for stopping by. I'm looking for, actually looking for Farkas now, where is Blood he? Running hot. Yes? Not you. You. I'm here to help. You train me to better use heavy I'll armor. I'll show you what I can about protecting yourself. Alright, just used all my gold. <laughs> I'm looking for work. Gotten a letter about someone needing some muscle out in the. I don't know what the fight is about. I just need you to go out there. No more than that. I don't want to hear about a killing. Understand? Get to it then. Okay, we're gonna go out and not kill someone. That might be difficult. Intimidate Breen and Merilis in Dawnstar. Okay, we can do that. Let's go sell some of these silver swords. Uh, and maybe look at grabbing some potion ingredients because I have no healing potions left now. I use them all up. Get in here. Got I'm trying to accidentally buy his stuff this time in here. instead of selling. Give a holler. Everything's for sale. Everything's for sale. Junk. Me, I call them treasure. This guy looks a bit like Wolverine, actually. Uh, where is it? Right, iron sword, sell that. I was going to disenchant that one. Lots of great swords. Okay, let's go and disenchant the stuff that back. I got. Up here in Dragon's Reach. Well, evil Satan, but Satan baby from hell, I just spent all my money on heavy armor training. Uh, so I don't know if I can actually take the carriage to Dawnstar. Uh, how much does it cost? Because I've only got 50 gold left now. Oh no, I just sold a bunch of stuff. No, I can probably afford it. I'll take that back. I just sold a load of silver weapons. So I should be good. Alright, and it's actually pretty cheap. Okay. Let's run up to Dragon's Reach. Uh, disenchant the stuff I've got. Break it down. Free up some space in the inventory, make whatever potions we can, and then we'll go do that uh, next quest. Oh, good. I'm feeling good about uh, about that crazy, that crazy dungeon, that crazy fight where I forgot to use my dragon shouts. Can you believe it? Right, disenchant orcish bow of fear. Uh, these are my actual ones. Let's see what enchantments we've got available. Fortify. I want fortify stamina regen, really. But let's fortify magicka regen, because that will help with healing. So, that one, uh, item I'll use 
the use a gold ring and then a soul gem that's the highest one we've got so we'll use that we'll do another enchantment fortify Do a fortify heavy armor on the silver ring. I'll just go equip. What would it be under apparel? <laughs> Gold ring, magic regeneration. Oh, you can only wear one ring. Okay. Fair enough. This I did not know. Right. Uh, what enchantment do I want? Fortify heavy armor. Soul gem. Uh, let's do it on the... Necklace. Let's just check that I actually can wear the necklace. Oh, it's the amulet of Kynarath. Oh, I don't want to change that. Okay, I think I will try and pick the item first. Cultist mask. Enchantment. Fortify Magicka Regen. Soul Gem. Done. Now, item. Uh, Falma Shield. Enchantment. Nothing. <laughs> okay, we can't enchant that. Uh, steel Shin Boots. Fortify Pickpocket. Rubbish. Okay, looks like we're done. Looks like we're done here. Let's make some potions and then we'll head out on the next quest. And then I think that's all. that's it. That's all I can do. Here, I'd like you to have this as a token of my friendship. You'd like me to have what? Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities, like the rest. It seems this damnable conflict has claimed everyone's spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. Okay, restoration spells cost 15% less to cast. That's... Oh, don't have enough gold. He gave me a cure poison potion. Okay, where do I see that when it comes up? Okay, I can't buy I can't buy any of this stuff. So I will go and do the you know, quest. If got the aptitude, you oh okay, so it comes up in the top left when you get given something. I heard a noise, but I didn't see like what it would actually be. On we go. Now one thing I would like to do is see if I can make that helmet I was talking about. Although it is fun wearing the cultist mask, I think I can get a better. I think I get a better helmet. Some kind of like three pronged helmet. Looks pretty cool. Started Dawn Guard. Speak with the leader of the Dawn Guard. But yeah, Satan Baby it is a little bit counterintuitive to put things in the top left corner, but then I suppose this is Bethesda game. Some good so. out here if you're it's to, to be expected. Uh, burp, 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 burp. Right, steel. Steel helmet. Steel horned helmet. Which is better? Steel helmet. These are the same. Uh, let's go for this one.
few there. Hi. The Dawn Guard is looking for anyone willing to fight against the growing vampire menace. What do you say? I've got no dwarven gear yet, no. Uh, what's the Dawn the Guard? Hunters. We search out and destroy those blood sucking scum wherever we find them. I haven't noticed the vampire menace. I certainly have. One of them attacked me. Killing vampires, where do I sign up? Ha! Ezron's going to like you. Go talk to him at Fort Dawn Guard, southeast of Riften. He'll decide if you're Dawn Guard material. Okay. Uh, the Van Helsing Skyrim faction says Satan, baby. Yeah, totally. Uh, let's see about improving I don't claim to be the, the helmet I just made. Uh, steel horned helmet. Oh, that'll actually reduce my armor rating. Well, that's not good. Let me see what happens when I improve it. I lack the required components. Can I buy steel ingot off of you? Have you met my father? Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much. Sell me stuff. Sell me stuff. Uh, steel arrow. Steel ingot. I just need one. All right, let's Don't improve that helmet. Check inside the shop if you need anything. Oh, so Satan Baby's telling me I should buy a pickaxe and look for iron mines to plunder. Okay, that sounds like a good idea. I actually saw a pickaxe lying around in a dungeon. I probably could have just used that one. Do, 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 do. All right, we'll equip that. Let's sell the cultist mask mm, blades, to helmets, pretty much I have a feeling we're going to be getting a lot more. Cool. And I'll take my lead then. Have a look at me. Hell yeah, look at that. That's more like it. You can actually see my cool face now. Oh, Roxanne, you're off to play some games now. See you in the next one, hopefully. Yeah, all right, cheers. Thanks for stopping by. Good to see you. I hope you uh, enjoyed me fighting against all those Draugr and getting stressed out and forgetting to use my dragon shouts. All right, I will uh, look into getting a pickaxe. I Can I buy father. one from her? You Let's think all the council might... Take a look. Misk. Pickaxe. No, you do not. You do not sell them. I'll take my leave then. I'll uh, just quickly run back up to Dragon's Reach. I'll enchant this helmet that I just made, uh, and then I'll go do the quest. <laughs> I keep saying, I'll go do the quest, I'll go do the quest. There's just so much stuff in Skyrim that's like downtime activities. I think that's part of what makes it so fun. Up to Dragon's Reach. So, Satan Baby, if there's a mine close by, where do I actually pick up a pickaxe from? Like, who would I buy it from? Um, Bellathor. They're just laying around in the mines. Alright, so we can go to a mine, pick up a pickaxe and do some mining. I feel like if I go into a mine, I'm going to get badly attacked by Draugr again. But that seems to just be how it is, right? <laughs> right? Let's enchant my new helmet. Enchantment, uh, fortify magic uh, regen. Soul gem. Petty. All right. So some mines lead to bigger adventures, says Satan Baby, crypts and things. Uh, let's upgrade my Magicka. Uh, I've got quite a lot in heavy armor, so let's have a look at my one-handed. How are we doing with all that? Fighting stance. 
hack and slash. Axes, attacks with war axes cause, cause extra bleeding damage. That's pretty good. Let's take that because I am using a war axe at the moment. Now I've got a choice here. Do I go do I go do the companion's quest that I just picked up? Do I go and do the mining thing that Satan Baby's talking about? Or go do I uh, do a, do I go and do some fishing? It's a tough one. The future of Mister, could you spare a coin? Who wants a coin? Looking for my husband Nazim. Check the Yarl's Nazim. backside. That's usually where he stuffs himself these days. Okay, I'm not looking for your husband, Nazim, but uh, I'm sure that uh, whatever he's doing up the Jarl's backside is a very important work. I work with my mother. Sell fruits and vegetables. It's fun most. Who's this person? Oh, this is Nazim. No. What game? Really? All right, you pick. Tag or hide and seek. I know all the good spots. You don't stand. You stand right there okay. and count to ten. No peeking. Ready? Okay, go. <laughs> Found you. You got what? Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Prepared or not, I'm coming. Okay, I'm I'm doing hide and seek. Uh, let's let's hide here. I'm it. Find someone. I don't want to play hide and seek. <laughs> uh, let's. That guy seems busy. Let's uh, let's just run away from here. I kind of want to do the dawn guard stuff and kill vampires, actually. So I'm going to have a look at the quests. Quest, Dawn Guard. Speak with the leader of the Dawn Guard. Intimidate Brino Merilis in Dawnstar. Let's go to Dawnstar. Oh, well, actually, Satan Baby, if you want to, if you want to direct me to this mine, I'll go there and pick up a pickaxe. We are the road makes this one weary. There's Dawnstar. Southeast of Riverwood. Uh, so, like, just leave Riverwood and go along the mountain. Okay, I'll fast travel to Riverwood. It's really close to Riverwood, okay. Let's go to the mine. Let's go to the mine and get a pickaxe. What could it mean? The return of the Dragonborn? Southeast, so this direction. Oh, could possibly hold that honor and such power. Uh-oh. Uh oh, it's a dragon o uh, I'm gonna drop a save here. And let's go fight a dragon. I don't actually have a companion at the moment. It'd be good if he landed on the ground. He just keeps landing on there. No. Maybe come over to me where the ground is.
Here we go. I'm on fire. I'm not on fire anymore. Is it coming back? They don't have any ranged attacks. The roads to Helgen. All right. Uh, for the roads to Helgen. Follow the road on the mountainside. I've just abandoned the dragon, so I don't think I can fight it. Too good. All right, I will abandon the dragon. I could have, I could have fought it if it was going to land on the ground, but it kept landing up on that roof. Mine is up behind you to the right. Okay. Good instructions. Excuse me. Is this it here? Ember shard mine. Right. I guess that dragon's going to be waiting for me when I get out, right? Okay. Let's drop a save. Come here, Archer. I've just fought loads of evil zombies. I'm not worried about you guys. Not one bit. Maybe you. Nice. Very dead. Nice and dead. Good job. Uh, let's uh, pop a bit of healing. I feel like less of a noob now. I feel a bit more like I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Okay, found the shields. Whoops. Okay, let's go investigate. Uh, Satan Baby, if you see a pickaxe, uh, let me know. Ingots, workbench, iron ore. Do I need to refine iron ore? Smithing increased to 22. Nice. And uh, Satan Baby says there's a pickaxe here somewhere too. All right, have a look around for it. Pickaxe, where are you? Fishing rod. Let's catch a fish. That river does not look very deep. Ah, <laughs> oh, building my line too early. Okay, try again. One more time. If I'm unsuccessful, I'll just go look for the pickaxe. Is there a smelter in that forge uh, area where I was in? I've clearly forgotten how to fish from yesterday. Okay, there's a smelter in Whiterun, so I can go. I may have to go and fight that dragon in order to... <laughs> in order to use it. A glass catfish. Alright. Let's re-equip my 
Axe. Well, I didn't see a pickaxe. Let's have another quick look around. Bum 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 ba dum bum bum ba dum bum bum ba dum bum bum. Hmm. Doesn't quite look like it. Never mind, maybe we'll find one. No, they're not, they're not carrying them. Maybe we'll find one further in the mine. Yeah. Satan Baby says, keep, keep on trucking. Keep on going down the mine. Hi-ho, hi-ho. It's off to work we go with a farmer axe and a big massive shield. Hi-ho. Hi-ho, hi-ho, hi-ho. You picked a bad time to get lost, friend. Oh, a fellow orc. You do realise that I killed a robot the other day, right? Ember shard mine key. Bucket. Okay, there's nothing in here, but I guess I can unlock other other areas. Pretty dark in here. Let's unlock this door. Go, 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 gold. Spell tome, clairvoyance. Oh, I already know that. The searcher's chest. Uh, Meridia's beacon. What the heck is that? Uh, Ruby. Novice robes of conjuration. Let's take those so that we can disenchant them. Uh, and let's maybe take this so we can disenchant it as well. A new hand touches Ooh. the beacon. The fuck? Oh, excuse my language. Listen, hear me and obey. A foul darkness has seeped into my temple. A darkness that you will destroy. Uh... Return okay. my beacon to Mount Kilcreath. And I will make you the instrument of my cleansing light. Uh The Break of Dawn. What the hell? Hey, did you know about this? Was there was there never a pickaxe here? If I plan on playing the Dawn Guard DLC, it should give you something that's going to be really useful for that. Oh, is the Dawn Guard the vampire killers? Meridia's Beacon is a random chest spawn. Oh. Okay. Maybe I should run back here and quick save, actually. Shield. There's a wolf behind you. Take this. Okay. There's a pickaxe somewhere in this area. So I've got Meridius Beacon. Alright, should I just like prioritize that quest then over everything else? seems pretty important. A read uh, journal. Tattered journal. They've had me working down here for days now. It's not the time it's getting to me though. It's these tunnels. I've told them countless times now to add extra supports. <laughs> I'll take your money, mate. Oh, that guy only had seven gold. To his name. Uh, 
Beaver. I probably didn't want to do that. Let's put that bridge back. Okay, so apparently the uh, door, the beacon quest is a <laughs> is a nuisance of a quest, says Satan Baby, but uh, it's it's worth it. Let me just eat one of these fly amanitas a minute. Uh, fly amanita, resist fire. Oh, cool. Pickaxe, 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 pickaxe. You saw it, I didn't. There it is. All right, I've got, I've got a pickaxe now. And an iron vein. Ah, cool. All right. Uh, is it under weapons? It probably is, isn't it? Here we go. Oh, you, oh, you press X. Right. Okay. <laughs> I was just attacking it. <laughs> this ore vein is depleted. <laughs> it's okay, when you play on PlayStation and a lot of things are, are, are like a PC game, you automatically convert like E to X in your mind anyway. Alright, let's uh, carry on down this way and see what's down here. So you didn't know that the beacon was going to be in that chest. Well, you did know. I wonder what that was. Oh, it spawns randomly. Okay. Interesting. Embershard mine discovered. It's a bad time to get lost, friend. One shot. I'll take your gold, thank you very much. Alright, so we now know where there's a mine. Useful. Uh, what do I want to go and do next? Uh, intimidate Brina, Merilis, and Dawnstar. So I think we'll fast travel back to Whiterun, and then we'll take the cart up to Dawnstar. Do that, and then maybe, then maybe do the beacon quest. Okay, so Satan Baby's telling me there's other mines around the world that give other ores. Very useful. Okay, so to get the next tier of armour, I need to do Dwarven Dungeons. Oh, uh, I need to talk to the guy. <laughs> I need to talk to the guy to go somewhere. Okie dokie. Need a ride? Yes, please. I'd like to go to Dawnstar. Where please. do you want to go? Climb and back, and we'll be off. All right, let's go. Oh, stay nice one. You're finally awake. Dawnstar. Dawn Star discovered. Now this is a town I do not recognise from when I played it before. I don't think... Oh no, because I did do the Companions quest, so I must have been here. I don't recognise it though. It looks awesome. Iron Breaker Mine is three times... Who do you think we're threatening? Hello, Brina Merrillis. We're not soldiers. I'm here to you, you come to Dawnstar at a bad time. Tempers are fiery. Uh, I've been sent to resolve a dispute. You can't scare me into submission. Let's go. 
Come on, let's see what you're made of. Who taught you to lie? Damn you. <laughs> I think I got her. <laughs> I just blasted her off the side. Nice. Okay, so I've unlocked Dawnstar. Um, I could have a look around here, or I could uh, go back, return to Farcast. Let's uh, let's do that because I can just fast travel back up there now. Might actually equip my stuff. Sweet. Farkas, we spoke to your lady and we blasted off the side of a cliff. There he is. Some people don't think. I figured you had it in you. Nicely done. Uh, cool. So, until next time, should I carry on with the companion stuff, or should I go and do the the beacon quest? Let's have a look at it on the map. Uh, so, break of dawn. Bring Meridia's beacon to Mount Kilcreath. I found a strange gem. An otherworldly voice is commanding me to bring it to Mount Kilcreath. See, like I was saying yesterday, this is the point where I start to get a bit overwhelmed with all the different options. Um, so let's just go with the one that's at the top uh, and the one that you said is a good idea. And we'll come back to the companions later. <laughs> Had a moment of indecision there. No indecision. No time for indecision. This is a, this is a serious, focused attempt at getting stuff done. Who are you, Amren? All right. Map. Uh, where is the? Statue to Meridia. Wow, okay. So I could... Is there a road to Mount Kilcreath? Well, I could actually get the carriage man to take me to Solitude and then just strike out west from there, couldn't I? I think I'm going to do that. Where is he? Garage man, where did you go? There he is. Hello, we're going to Solitude this time. I can take you to any where do you want to go? Climb and back and we'll be off. Only twenty gold, what bargain. Oh, uh, Satan Baby's telling me to uh, do what feels the most fun. Well the most fun I think I wanna go for that. That sure quest, you're... and I want to, I want to kill vampires. That sounds really cool. I can always come back to the companion stuff later. Uh, let's. Uh... It's one in the morning, so we will. Wait five hours here. <laughs> Just standing in the road, so it's daytime, and then um, head out west. So yeah, if I if I do the quest that gives me the companion superpower, I can do werewolves versus vampires, which is pretty cool. Go full twilight. I'd like to do that. I think I'm going to do this Meridian quest first. 
get whatever that item is, and then kind of maybe go back to the companions after that, get the werewolf power, and then fully go for the dawn star, dawn star stuff. Dawn star, dawn guard. Running down the road. I'm reliably informed in the chat that I'm going to like the reward from this quest. I believe you, I believe you. You haven't let me you haven't let me down so far. Hello. I'm on Aldous. a pilgrimage to the shrine in the mountains to the northeast. I'll mark it on your map. Okay. Thanks. Right, we're going up around here. And this looks like this looks like the spot up here. Let's drop a quick safe. Look at my temple lying in ruins. So much for the constancy of mortals, their crafts and their hearts. If they love me not, how can my love reach them? Good question, Meridia. Explore to me, my beacon, that I might guide you toward your destiny. So, Satan Baby, one of the reasons I keep picking up flowers is because because before I started playing this, I had been watching Spiffing Brit, um, and he was playing survival mode, so constantly picking stuff up. Replace the beacon. Okay, let's drop the quick save here in case this summons some kind of monster. Uh, where am I going? I'm going into space. It is time for my splendor to return to sky. Whoa, look at this. But the token of my truth lies buried in the ruins of my once great temple. Wow. Now tainted by a profane darkness skittering within. The necromancer Malkara defiles my shrine with vile corruptions. Trapping lost souls left in the wake of this war to do his bidding. Meridia, your Worse thing him, is very bright he uses the power in my eyes. Within my own token to fuel his foul deeds. I have brought you here, mortal, to be my champion. You will enter my temple, retrieve my artifact, and destroy the defiler. Uh, tell me more about this artifact, Mortals bright lady. Call it Dawnbreaker, for it was forged in a holy light that breaks upon my foes, burning away corruption and false life. You will enter my shrine, destroy a mighty Malkarin, blade, and retrieve this mighty blade. Okay, sounds good. <laughs> Oh, I don't, I'm not going to be sassy with her. We'll say I'll do it. Um, Satan Baby's telling me the Aedra and Daedra can be fickle. Of course I know will. what Daedra are. Well, Aedra are like the angel versions. Like the opposite. Go now. The artifact must be reclaimed and Malkarin destroyed. Okie dokie. Malkarin has forced the door shut. But this is my temple and it responds to my decree. I will send down a ray of light. Guide this light through my temple and its doors will open. Okie dokie. Oh, I haven't got my axe in my hand anymore. So apparently Satan Baby says, uh, Adria are the beings that gave their power willingly to create Mundus, the planet you're on, as well as some other planets that actually represent them. The Daedra exists outside of this plane of existence. Kind of like the warp in Warhammer 40k or Warhammer Fantasy. Got you. Got you, got you, got you. Activate gem pedestal. Okay, let's have a look at the quest because I'm not actually sure what to do. 
Guide Viridia's light through the temple. Activate. Gem pedestal. Do I need a gem for that? Okay, where is the door to the dungeon? There it is. Here we go. This looks like a big dog's nose. Click safe. Weapons out. Let's do this. So I'm guessing, Satan baby, that this is like a one hell of a temple, right? Uh, because of that, I shall be just very so quickly taking a break, uh, making a cup of tea. I'll be back in about five minutes. All right. See you shortly.
All right, here we go. Okay, got a cup of tea, got a couple of biscuits, got a bottle of water. Let's rock. Should I get a companion for this? <laughs> Actually, now that I think about it. I probably should, right? Uh, let's, uh, let's... I've been back to Dragon Reach about 300 times and I forgot to pick her up. Uh, Oh, there we go. <clears throat> Couldn't find where it was. She is sworn Damn to carry my burdens, is Lydia. Oblivion. They want to back the storm close. They'll forget what's coming to them. She better not be asleep. I don't think Lydia does sleep, to be fair. All right, patrolling. Hello. I am your so honored to see you. Lead the way. <laughs> Do you say maybe saying Lydia's a low key hottie? Have you got a thing for Lydia? Have you? <laughs> That's funny. Let's get back up here. At the end of this stream, I'm going to. Have a serious, serious think about giving Lydia some better equipment. Oh, around here. Excuse me. <clears throat> right, here we go. <laughs> well, Satan baby, if Lydia is your type, then Lydia is your type, and there's nothing you can do about it. You might as well roll with it. Is it, it's not really to do with the way she looks at all, is it? It's uh, the fact that she runs in and just tanks all the hits. I hear footsteps in this dungeon. And I see a thing. Is there a lever somewhere? Unlock wooden door. How many lockpicks do I have left? 29. Should be alright. You are joking me. Come on. This is the one. This is... <laughs> oh man, I'm just chewing through lockpicks here. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Lever. Hopefully this one won't trap me in. Yeah, so Satan Baby's confirmed it is uh, it's because Lydia is a warrior woman. Steel plate armor, gold, minor healing. Hey, is that armor better than mine then? Steel armor. Steel plate armor. It is better. Let's equip that. I know, I know that I've got enchantment for the heavy armor skill on the other armor, but that's fine. Yeah, plate is better. What I'll do is uh, I'll I'll run back to Dragon Reach after the quest and I'll buff it up with an enchantment. Okay, so I see a laser beam. I see the light beam from from before. Uh, There's a big fire thing there. So let's, uh, let's have a nosy about before we press anything. Do a bit of looting if it's possible. There seems to be a lot of desecrated corpses here. Lydia, did you just hurt me? Right. This room looks fairly unoccupied. Activate pedestal. Okay. 
And is that going to fibre optically link to the next thing? Oh, did that open the door? Okay, I think that opened the door. I've got a bad feeling about this. Uh, corrupted shade. Come on, Bobby, get in there and fight him. Die, die, die. That's one dead. Really don't want to be attacking Lydia. Sorry, Lydia. Sorry, Lydia. Steel battle axe. Oh, they've not got, um, they don't carry gold or anything. Ghostly remains. So these guys just have weapons on them from the looks of it. That's fine. So apparently this one's got loads of uh, fighting and puzzle solving. Is it a DLC? It must be a DLC if it's part of the um, Dawn Guard thing, right? Oh, it's part of the main game, okay. So it's just a coincidence that uh, the item you get at the end of the game says Satan Baby is really good for the Dawn Guard. I mean, I suppose anything that's geared up towards undead, right? Or specifically vampires. All right. Let's activate you. Touch the beacon. Oh, dawn breaker, not dawn guard. Sorry, dawn breaker. Got my got my DLC names wrong. Okay, can I get through there? Lydia, we need to jump across here. Uh, looking around, looking around. Oh, Sam, you're going to head up to my house now. Alright, see you in a bit. Okay. Can I get across? Let's have, a, let's have a look here. Because this is all blocked, so we can't go here. So let's work back from here. Jumped over the other side, there was no access. So, go here. Let's jump on top of that wardrobe thing, bookshelf thing. And here. And is there a space here? Yes. Come on, I want to get, I want to get through that. <laughs> Crouch down. I get through. Come on, let me through. Let me through. <laughs> I'm guessing this isn't the way. Right, fine. Interesting. Right, so it's neither of those. Those are ruled out. That's okay. I have a process of going around ruling things out. I'm guessing it might be this door that's just opened. What do you reckon? <laughs> Uh oh, someone's got arrows. I've just got a lot of HP. Die! I'm soul trapping them, but they have to have souls. That's the question. It appears like they do. Ghostly remains. Go the trash. Okay, quick safe. Uh, 
light beam coming through here. Can I get through here? All right, Wolfie, let's go through the door. And through this door. Right. Chest. A potion of healing. Fantastic. That's what I always wanted. It's like Christmas come early. There's a couple of baddies in here. Where are they? There they are. Come on, Wolfie, take him out. Nice. Why are they shot at? <laughs> Things have gone wrong. Things have gone wrong. Let's get the weapon back and the shield. That did not work the way I wanted. Proper shield pack. Nice. Yes, mistakes were made. I wanted to heal and uh, I ended up like just having a fist swinging around. There we go. Da -da, da -da. All right, let's continue. Quick save. That little tip from King Blocked uh, to just quick save everywhere was uh, was great. Yes, um, double double handing the spells so that they work faster was kind of what I was going for, but I just messed it up. Okay, this looks like this is the door to go through. It requires a key. Let's just loot around. And, uh, what's over there? Activate pedestal. Ah, it didn't require a key, it required an orb, a beacon. Kill Creek Balcony. All right. Never seen any, huh? Hi, Lydia. Interesting. Yes, Satan Baby, it is a spicy talking ball. <laughs> I'm expecting to meet a, a necromancer here at some point. Well, I've got 28 lockpicks and this is an expert level one. So I'm going to spend for no more than five. Oh. Okay, that was five. I'm gonna I'm gonna try one more. One up, buddy, got it. Okay, dwarven mace of weariness. Weight sixteen. Okay, we're getting pretty close to the carry weight there. Seven hundred and seventy-seven gold. Potion of resist shock. Orcish battle axe of harrowing. That absorbs magicka. Well, I want to take that, but uh, I am out of carry weight. Hmm. Let's have a look at that weapon. Dwarven Mace of Weariness. There's 10 points of stamina damage. And it's more damage. I think I'm going to equip that, yeah. And if I need to soul trap, I'll, I'll just quickly put the other one on. Uh, anything I can ditch? Yeah, I'll just I'll drop this and then I can pick up the. There we go. All right, I got me a dwar a dwarven shiny mace. 
It does stamina damage, which is actually pretty cool, right? It stops them being able to do power attacks. CMS, how are you doing? Oh. Satan baby, CMS is another member of the Discord server and a, a regular viewer and good friend. Um, one of the few people on the Discord server who isn't a fellow content creator. Just a guy who loves games uh, and is very sarcastic. We just installed that Pokemon thing. I don't know if you saw it, uh, where you catch Pokemon in the Discord server. It's lots of fun. Power attack. Yeah. Okay. We can sit on the throne. Let's sit on the throne. Oh. Can I have a sit down while in combat? That's a travesty. Oh, yeah, if you got to go to bed, I mean, it's quite late in Germany, right? <laughs> if you got to go to bed, that's cool. Um, I appreciate you uh, showing up. Showing up and saying hi. We're doing a, a quest in Skyrim to get a weapon that's good against uh, vampires, basically. A cool sword called Dawnbreaker, I think. Lydia looks like she's taking care of everything for me. Uh, there's an enemy on the board somewhere. Here's one. Hello, Corrupted Shade. Got ya. Desecrated corpse, 25 gold, thank you very much. Okay. So, the way looks like it's at the top. This requires a key, as does that. So I've got to get to there. Let's have a look around. Let's have a little looky around you. First things first, let's get up high. Where did I come in? Came in over there. Oh, there's the stairs. <laughs> Satan, baby, and Siamath are both huge fans of Lydia. Right, activate pedestal. That's that done. Uh, corrupt shades coming through. He looks like he's stuck up on there. So that's fine. Um, I did see another door before. Go up this way, where was it? Here it is, right. Let's deal with whatever's through here. Quick save. So yeah, CMS, um, Lydia is, has been a great companion so far, way better than Farkas was, who just disappeared. Um, but uh, I know that when I get the werewolf upgrade, she's not going to like me anymore. So I'll have to find someone else. Probably one of the companions. Gold lockpick potion of healing. Thank you very much. That's it. That's it, Lydia. You bash. Bash. All right, we are cooking with gas. So I need to get to the next section. I think activate the next uh, beacon is the... Whoa! Is there a, pl a plate here? I guess we'll switch that uh, trap off. Let's go through here. There's a guy to fight at the end. Come on, Corrupted Shade. Where did you go? Or have you already come? Uh, they've already come. Get me. Sixty gold. Stamina potion. Battle of Red Mountain. Block increased to thirty-four. Yes, please. Uh, so going through that trap, I should have used the whirlwind uh, shout. I was actually thinking of that, but I was just like, Do you know what? I could just run through here quicker. So, uh, so that's exactly what I did.
because I'm on the PlayStation again without the hotkeys, uh, I think it's just sometimes a bit of a faff to switch the shouts around. Activate pedestal. That's is that, that door down there? There's another one up there. Okay, how do I get up there? Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, I see a door that's opened there. So let's look at the map and try and work out what the access to that might be. The door behind me to the right. <laughs> oh, I see it. This door, this door in front of me, do you mean? Satan Baby. I'm being guided through by Satan Baby in the chat. Okay. I think this is the door I came in through, wasn't it? No, it was not. Okay. Oh, when power attacks mix, it is pretty heartbreaking. <laughs> right, got him. Cool beans. Hey, look, Satan, baby, man, if you're wrong, it's fine, because I didn't know where I was going either. So between the two of us, we'll we'll work out uh, where to go. There's the, there's the beacon. Beacon sandwich. All right, and there's the main door. Sweet. I fell down. Let's just quickly heal. Awesome. Right, now we're into Kill Crease Catacombs. And yeah, um, one of the ways I navigate these dungeons is I loot everything. So if stuff is empty, if it's all empty, I know I've been there. And yeah, obviously you have to kill everything anyway. But by killing everything, if there's if there's enemies, you know, you know you're going the right way. I don't think that's just me. I don't think that's any sort of major revelatory game strategy. Okay, desecrated corpse. Activate. That was an easy bit of puzzle. Thanks, thanks, Skyrim. Hmm. Interesting. I hear something. Let's take a sip of tea and ponder this. Okay. Venture forth. Okay, there's Malkoran. So it might be time to load up on some potions. I think first things first, we'll just quick save here. And then, yeah, potions. What would be good? I feel like a lot of these might be... One point of poison damage. Ten seconds. Yeah, that could be useful. What magic does he do? Potion to fortify health. One corrupt shade down. If I can get rid of the minions, as long as they don't respawn, that does make the main fight a lot easier. That's always been my strategy. It sucks, but it's Skyrim, XCOM, D&D, &D, whatever. 
There he is. Looks like he's doing frost. Okay. Let's uh, grab some healing. Good work. Found my shield. Just realised I want to be favouriting that mace. Uh, where is it? Where's the? Where's my shield? There it is. Okay, now we're kitted out. Cool. Right, this guy. Let's use the pillars. Stun him. Attack him. Stun him. Attack him. Uh, potions. Have I got a stamina potion? Smack that necromancer punk. Yeah, I think I'm going to be draft of resist magic. Draft of health. Uh, draft of resist magic. Uh, and frostbite venom. Uh, I need to run and heal. Run and heal. Run and heal. I can't move. Oh my gosh. Uh... Oh my gosh, that was... Why can I not move? Go on, Lydia, trash him, smash him, trash him. That stuff that he's doing is nasty. It's some nasty stuff. Where is my... There it is. Alright mate, don't you get up. Weapon recharge. Your weapon has been fully drained of charges. To recharge it, select it in your inventory. Press R1. Select a filled soul gem to use and press X to confirm. Your weapon will be recharged and the soul gem will be consumed. Got it. Huzzah! Oh, oh, hello, what are you doing? Mark around shade. Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's level up. <laughs> Thank you, Satan Baby, for reminding me to level up. I think I need to put a point into... I uh, actually need to put a point into Magicka, I think. I'm relying on that stuff a bit more. And then... In terms of perks... What's going on with heavy armor here? I am on 45. Ooh. Well fitted power of strength. Fists of steel. Unarmed attacks with heavy armor gauntlets do that armor rating and extra damage. You think I should drop it into healing, yeah? Okay. I've got one point in healing, so. Restoration Dual Casting. Dual Casting a Restoration Spell overcharges the effect into an even more powerful version. Uh, okay, I have put points into Heavy Armor, but not a huge amount. Healing Spells cure 50% more. Let's go for that. That feels like the way forward, yeah. Just like the obvious buff, isn't it? 50% is such a huge jump. Malcolm Shade was a big pansy. It is done. The Defiler is defeated. Take Dawnbreaker from its pedestal. Uh, I've got to loot his body first, actually. Necromancer robes. He's just got trash on him. He's got absolute trash. Look at it. Look at the state of it. I'll take that and I'll disenchant it, but I think I've already got that disenchantment. Uh, that enchantment, sorry. Let's loot everyone, though. Because there's going to be a lot of gold. This Adra isn't bothered that I'm like looting desecrated corpses, I'm guessing. She just wants her temple sorted. I, I stumbled on the word desecrated there. I thought I was going to say desiccated, like desiccated coconut, <laughs> which is kind of true. It's kind of dried out. 
Okay, here we go. Activate pedestal. Completed. Retrieve Dawnbreaker. Daedric Influence. I got a PlayStation trophy for that. Malkorin is vanquished. Skyrim's dead shall remain at rest. This is as it should be. This is because of you. A new day is dawning. And you shall be its herald. She's certainly got a Take flair for the dramatic Casma video. And with it purge corruption from the dark corners <laughs> of the world. See math in the chat is like another hand touches the beacon. Influence may grow. Uh, now, I've got a choice here. I'll keep the sword, but find someone else to spread your religion, or I'll wield this mighty blade in your name. Which one should I go for? I kind of inclined to do this one, even though she's a bit silly. I'm kind of inclined to go for the, uh, the second one. Uh, Satan Baby says that I jumped in my seat when I got the beacon. I certainly did. I was like, ooh, I wasn't expecting the voice to come out of nowhere. Well, I'll humour her. I'll humour her and wield the mighty blade in her name. Why not? It keeps giving me the fishing uh, instruction. Activate gem pedestal. Oh, okay, that's all done. Let's have a look at my new sword! New sword, new sword, new sword. Oh, there it is, Dawnbreaker. Oh, yeah! Look at that! That is awesome! Okay, burns for 10 points. And when killing undead, a chance to cause a fiery explosion that turns or destroys to near undead. Well, hello, sword. That is absolutely wicked. Oh, thanks so much for directing me through the quest. That's, uh, that's really cool. Um, Give it a few swings, shall we? I want to go fight some vamps now. So I suppose the question is, should I go do another companion quest, or should I just go straight to the uh, what is it, the Dawn Guard quest? Uh, Dawn Guard. Speak with the leader of the Dawn Guard. I think we're going to do that. Let's go. Uh, let's go slash up some vamps. Dust some vamps. Uh, speak with the leader of the Dawn Guard. Okay, let's have a look. Where is that? Over here somewhere. Is that in White Run? Oh, so the Dawn Guard DLC is quite hard at my level. Should I do the companion quests first then? Help me get leveled up. It doesn't matter because I can't find the bloody quest marker anyway. Oh, it's over here. So the recommended level for Dawn Guard is at least 30. Alright, I'm like level. I don't even know what level I am. Uh, level 14. Okay. I think I'm going to go do the companion's quests then. Yeah. Alright. Let's get back to... What's it called? White run. We'll run in, disenchant some crap that we don't need anymore. <laughs> Can you put two enchantments on the same weapon or not? I'm guessing you probably can't. Okay, so you can put two enchantments on once you get Master Enchanter. Interesting. Let's disenchant the Dwarven Mace of Weariness. I already know that one. The Orcish Battle Axe of Harrowing and the Novice Robes of Conjuration. Uh, can I enchant the Falmer Shield? No, I can't. I think for now I'm kind of happy with my loadout of enchantments and stuff, so I'll probably just 
sell off any excess equipment I've got and then go and speak to the companions. I'll probably need to leave Lydia if... Oh no, I can take Lydia. Okay, so apparently shield enchantments are very hard to come by. Which makes sense. Oops. Let's go grab another companion's quest. So with companions, do you just have to do a few quests from each person? Is that kind of how that works? Mm -hmm. Oh, and uh, Satan Baby's saying that uh, he believes they fixed the bug where she attacks you if you turn into a werewolf. Well, that's good, because that's what she did to me like 10 years ago when I played it. Yeah. I've been tending and it was funny, but it was sad, because I'd invested quite a lot in Lydia by that point. Right. I'm tracking the wrong quest. Yeah, I am. Oh, it looks like I don't have any companions' actual quests, so that's interesting. I see everything here. Okay, let's wait till eight thirty in the morning. Go to the shop. I think I spoke to Far Farkas. Um, and got the money, but... Uh, I don't see, like, a quest thing in the quest log to go and, to go and talk to them. They're probably there, I just didn't spot it. Let's go talk to them anyway. I'm still trying to figure out... If the circle vouches for you, I'm sworn to respect. I need to block. It might save your life. There we go. I've, I've just done. Just trained a load of block. She doesn't have a quest for me, though. Let's find someone else. Talian, thank you so much for stopping by. Uh, enjoy your uh, dinner date with yourself, your Tuesday night dinner date with yourself. I actually really like going to uh, places on my own, like if Samantha's busy or whatever, and just go, just go and have a meal by myself. The Don Mayor of Skyrim. Thanks for stopping by the stream. Um, I hope you enjoyed what we've been doing so far, uh, the, the Dawnbreaker quest. Where are these people? Hello? Maybe, maybe they're up top having breakfast. Who are you? I just spoke to you. Right. Ah, Ayla the Huntress. I'm looking for work. Still eager to plead. He has something special planned for you. Better talk. Ah, to here we go. This might be the key. The silver hand. When the Empire surrendered to the old Mary Dominion, they shamed us all. Ah, there you are. You wanted to see me? Yes. I have something a little different planned this time. But it's not for everyone to hear. We will speak more. I forget that you've never seen it. The door is hidden. But I. I wish more of a... I've started seeing the... I've... I would trust okay. anyone here with my life, which is more than I'd say for the milk drinkers who raised So tonight we got to meet him uh, under the Skyforge. Let's go there now. And we'll just... we'll just wait.
So Skyforge is here. Uh, is it like down there? I guess is, this looks like a secret door. Uh, let's wait. What time does night time start? Uh, let's go with eight hours and see what happens. Nope, it's... <laughs> they all just spawned in down there, did you see? <laughs> uh, let's uh, wait two more hours and see if it gets dark. Oh, 8 p.m. All right. I've heard you may actually be stronger than you look. Perhaps we can hunt together someday. Here's the guy. Hello. Not now. The Underforge tonight. Wait, wait one more hour. Not now. The there Underforge is. tonight. Not now. Okay, let's wait one more hour. Underforge tonight. Not now. Oh, the have I bugged this? Uh, I'll go away. Let's go through a door, come back out. I was blocking him. All right. <laughs> Satan baby has explained that I was blocking his, his way. That's funny. I'm ready for whatever test is next. This is next. no test, new blood. This is a gift. Are you prepared? Here's all you need to know. Yorvaskur is the oldest building in Whiterun. The Skyforge was here long before it was. And the Underforge taps an ancient magic that is older than men or elves. We bring you here to make you stronger, new blood. Now let's What work. a mighty gift it is indeed. Okay, here we go. I'm glad you the Underforge. It's been a long time since we had a heart like yours. That pitiful ceremony behind the hall does not befit warriors like us. You are due more honor than some calls and feasting. I would hope you recognize Ayla, even in this form. She's agreed I to be your. Do you recognize her because she's got her name? We do this in secret because Codlack is too busy trying to throw away this great gift we've been granted. He thinks we've been cursed, but we've been blessed. How can something that gives this kind of prowess be a curse? So we take matters into our own hands. To reach the heights of the Companions, you must join with us in the shared blood of the Wolf. Are you prepared to join your spirit with the Beast World, friend? Uh, what if I don't want to be a werewolf? <laughs> but I do, so Very I'm well. ready. <laughs> Blood just appears out of nowhere. <laughs> Use Underforge Fountain. Okay, Ayla. Okay, Skewer. Here we go. Glob, 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 glob. Glob, 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 glob. Beast form added. Yeah, she's not attacking me, look. Let's go for a... Let's go for a wee jog. Oh, we'll go back in the forge? Oh, I was going to go out and... Oh, sugar. I'm being attacked by guys. Surely they must know. Lydia, no! Don't attack them. <laughs> Lydia's very loyal, like, attacking her own guards. There's a secret tunnel out of town. Oh, I see, yeah. Okay. <laughs> nice. Do I hear a dragon? Ah, something's Over loading. Here. Are you awake? I was starting to think you might never come back. Yours was not an easy transformation, but you're still alive, so congratulations. We even have a celebration planned for you. There's a pack of werewolf hunters camped nearby, at Gallows Rock. The Silver Hand, 
I think you've met them before. We're going to slaughter them. All of them. Lead on. Skior's already scouting ahead. You'd think that werewolf hunters would be better at killing werewolves. They wouldn't just get like absolutely trashed. Uh, am I a werewolf now? You have the blood of the wolf in you. Just be careful where you do it. Some cowards in this land can't... You were born into the past. I almost envy you. You gave us even more trouble than Farkas did at his first turning. Nothing. Then... It doesn't last long, though. The blood of your foes... The more we feed, the greater our prowess will grow. We could... Cure? Ha! Huh. I... I shouldn't... I love Codlac. I respect... If he's worried about some mead-swilling afterlife and... The Silver Hand have taken over the old fort at Gallows Rock. All right. They always make such easy prey. Let's, uh... Let's go and deal with these Silver Hand people. Kill the werewolf hunters. Oh, Samantha's here. I'm just going to unlock the door. Sorry, I didn't realise that was locked. Sure. You alright? Yeah. Okie dokie, let's kill some werewolf hunters. Embrace the gift of her, her scene. How do I actually transform? transform? Yeah, I've got the werewolf. Powers. Aha! Right Until next time. These guys wouldn't know I was a werewolf. Bruh. Speed. Where are they? There's, a, there's one up top. Oh, here you go. Feed. <laughs> nom 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 nom. I always feel sorry for these people. Almost. You can do an attack with both hands. Oh, do you just hold both buttons? Let's go into the house. Huh? Oh, Ayla's not a... Uh... Look at this. Cowards must have locked the place down after Skior charged in. You can taste the fear. The spell button lets out a howl. Oh, cool. There's a chain, there's a chain, there's a chain, there's a chain. I don't see it. Uh, oh, I see it. Activate. Okay, here we go. Let's go kill some Silver Hand. Rah! This is very satisfying. Oh, you're still alive. There's a dead one, isn't there? Thought so. Nobody we know by the smell. Some can't separate the animal from themselves. Go feral. Sprinting into a power strike. We should keep moving. So werewolf part available. Do I just uh, go? Ah, here we go. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Bestial strength. Totem of the Ice Brothers. Totem of the Moon. All right. Let's go for bestial strength. Nice. Oh, is that a dead werewolf? Rough. Oh, 
Uh, oh, that's where I came down from. Excuse me, Ayla. I suppose I can't loot as a werewolf, so I have to just come back as a as a human and uh, clear the place out. No surprise they keep vermin around. Don't be so wobbly. There's someone there. Oh, they're afraid. <laughs> It's saying werewolf perk progress increase, so that's Ayla. Nom 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 nom. Yeah, I'm trying to beat it, it's gonna let me. Ah, I was being attacked while feeding, that's interesting. So, I can't remember where I quick saved actually. Just here, alright, we should be able to get. We should be able to reclaim that progress pretty quickly. Look at this. Cowards must have locked the place down after Skior charged in. You can taste the fear. I'm stuck. I'm stuck in this thing. There we go. Good old roar got me out of there. Do, 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 do. There he is. Bloodlust extended, quick save. Oh, so Satan Baby's telling me that there is a unique armor at the end of this dungeon. Oh, wrong way. What is it? Like um heavy that heavy armor like I wear. Like I normally wear. No surprise they keep right. That pressure pad. The arm is pretty effective against uh, my slashy hands, actually. Stop blocking. Oh man. Okay. Let's let Ayla help us a little bit. So what's the waiting mini game? Apparently there's a mini game. Companions are pretty metal. <laughs> Don't forget to eat all the hearts, says Sam. Alright. Sam, it's quite cool that you're talking in the chat while you're also sat next to me. I like a mod. Like a chat mod. Like a chatbot. Cute chatbot. Uh, where are all the enemies? Oh, I'm being, I'm being attacked. Stop it. I thought uh, it was already dead. You can't come out of werewolf form by any means other than waiting. Unless, hmm. So there are further werewolf gifts available apparently. Oh, okay. Double hand attack. 
key to execute sometimes. Oh no, I shouldn't feed when I can still see a red dot. Right, where are you? Where are you, buddy? To die, no. I need to remember to use the roar. Okay, what should I increase? Werewolf totem of brotherhood. How calls ice wolves. Oh. Okay. Oh, I, yeah, okay, I see. Uh, I had thought I'd leveled that up, but I died. Come on, guys, come out here and attack me. <laughs> Josh says, Josh says, how are you finding Skyrim, idiot noob? I'm feeling less of a noob. Still a bit of an idiot. Still a bit of an idiot at times. But less newbie. More like a novice. Oh no, I pressed feed. Ah, oh, I didn't want to do that. Okay, so I should take the right side path on the perk tree, right? I can do that when I get my next perk. Is the left side path more sort of magic stuff? Or is it like contingent on items that I'm not going to have for a while? Let's just recharge my stamina. If I can get between them and make them run away, and stay away from me while I feed. Werewolf perk progress increased. Stop running away. Quite a few of them behind that door. Or down these stairs. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> Ayla, you hold them off while I eat. Quick save. So Josh is asking if I've ever played Time Crisis. I certainly have. Played it in the arcade and on the PS1. Um, where you can use the, P the second PS1 controller as a foot pedal. Absolutely awesome game. Graphically it's a bit dated now, but it's still good. I actually haven't played it obviously in about 10 to 15 years. Kev the Skinner. Oh, he cares. Oh, it's crap. Oh, it's cool, Kev. Kevin. There we go. I've killed Kev the Skinner. Yeah, I love games like Ty Cry Time Crisis. There were quite a few out in the like late nineties. Uh, I loved uh, Point Blank as well. Oh, I can't loot. I'm trying to loot this idiot. Oh, there's still people left alive. Why would you be left alive? I submit. I submit. Look at the size of my head. Uh. 
this. You're regretting becoming a werewolf hunter now. Alright. Right, did I feed on this guy? Whoa, what happened there? Is that a glitch? <laughs> Look at the, the whole dungeon's disappeared. I thought that was like Meridia coming again to, to talk to me. Let's consume this one as well. The Skyrim werewolf design is one of your favourite designs. Bastards! Somehow they managed to kill Skior. He was one of the strongest we had. But numbers can overwhelm. He should not have come without a shield brother. Get out of here. I'm going to make sure we got the last of them. And see if there's any information to be gotten from the bodies. You and I have work to do. The Silver Hand will tremble at our sight. So I think I missed what's happening because I was reading about scarp cables. Did Skewer get killed? Good that you're so eager. I've caught wind that one of the brighter silver hands oh, is sniffing sorry, around Skewer. the Sorry, I liked him. If you can sneak into their camp and steal his plans, we'll have the advantage. I'm going to find whoever did this. How do I unbeast? Just wait. Oh, as in wait, wait. Right, right. I thought you meant like actually wait, like an actual hour in your life. There we go. Right, Skewer, where are you? Where's his body? Oh, hello. Wolf armor, wolf boots. Uh, this is. These are all not as good as what I'm wearing. He unalived himself, yeah. I'll take them, but... Uh... <coughs> I guess I'll just sell this stuff. Sorry, Skewer, we should probably bury you, actually. What are you doing that for? I'm going to bury it. Oh, never mind. Let's look in this chest. Gold. Spell tome. Turn lesser undead. Steel warhammer of draining. Nice. Right. I need to ditch some stuff. I'll leave those because uh, they are the warhammer is more valuable to disenchant. Uh, well, they're safely in this chest. I could always come back and get them once I have a house. Um, if you if you guys remind me, I'll come back and get them. <laughs> Put them on an armor dummy. Uh, how do I get out of here? Do they have like a wolf? like a wolf's head on them or something like that. Huh? Alright, let's quick save and let's just quickly loot this. Hey! Oi! You're on fire now and it's your fault. Hello Starchip, how are you doing? We've just been discussing... PlayStation 1 light gun games. Um, the fact that Skewer went ahead and got himself killed, uh, but his armor wasn't as good as we thought. And uh, somebody attacked me and I set them on fire. Let's go through and pick up all the reagents, all the, all the loot. Ouch. That was silly. 
actually knew that I was there as well. What have you been up to, Starchip? Do you like my new sword? I've got Dawnbreaker. We did the beacon quest. Another hand touches the beacon, which is apparently a significant thing. A flute! I need to loot all the people I killed, which is quite a few. I'm carrying too much because I picked up a potion. Uh, what else can I ditch? There we go. Right, let's just go get all the gold. <laughs> blister wart. Oh, blister wart. That's new. Uh, ingredients. No, I had already eaten blister wart, it turns out. Oops. Some more people. Gold. Right, we're nearly done, we're nearly done, we're nearly done. I guess werewolves can't uh, do lock picking. Hmm. Interesting. Got it. No. Ah. Oh. Break my heart. Why don't you lock? Cool. Got it. <laughs> so you're Bulgarian, right, uh, Kos Costa? Because I used to know a guy from Greece whose name was Kostis, but his nickname was Costa. We used to call him Costa Coffee. Great story, babe. <laughs> he liked it. He liked the nickname. He, he wasn't uh, like weird about it. Uh, let's get rid of this sword. Search the dresser. A hat. Nice. Soul gem. Oh, I accidentally took a bowl. Didn't want that. Huh? There was a what? Ooh, nice. Right. There's a lot. Looting, as, not looting as you go, it makes it really weird going around afterwards just, just looting bodies. It's very strange. I think I'm nearly done. This is the final room. Hello. Hello, Ayla. Let's just do some tanning in here, why not? All right, let's get out of here. Oh, what's this? Potion of healing, lovely, I'll take that.
Um, okay, right. So I think what I'll do next is kind of like White Run is my is my base. So I'm gonna whip back to Dragon's Reach, go and disenchant all that crap I've got, <laughs> uh, make a bunch of potions, and then uh, strike out and do another quest. I think. So in the chat, you're all talking about World of Warcraft. I played a little bit of it. Did Sam, did you play World of Warcraft? Yeah, uh, okay. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities. I had a little the character that was a gnome, a gnome mage. Okay, looks like I've got everything else I could. It seems this damnable conflict has claimed everyone's passions of late. Me? I prefer my Have you got the sound on, on that? And my spells. I think it's coming. I think it's looping. I've only got it on very quietly, so I can hear. Oh, like, where, yeah, where it's at. <laughs> yeah, it's like feeding back through my microphone into my ears. I haven't got the music on. Okie dokie, right. Uh, I'm gonna make some potions. There's a tranquility in magic. Uh, guys in the chat, are you able to hear the game? I, um, when uh, the stream wasn't working earlier, I messed around with the PlayStation settings and I wasn't sure if I'd destroyed the audio. I'm going to make some resist fire. Resist frost. Restore magic and restore stamina. Nice. It's a good haul. Right, let's go and uh, let's go and sell a load of trash that I can't disenchant. Clear out the inventory and start all over again. So, uh, Cost Costadin, do you prefer being called Satan Baby or Costa or? Pali, do I see? It sounds like it looks like the word paladin in Bulgarian, something like that. Let me know. Let me know what is the preferred term, and I'll stick to it. Just Costa, yeah, thought so. It's a shame, isn't it? I have one of those surnames where. It just, it's its own nickname, you know? So I get called by my surname a lot, or my first name. Everything's for sale, I don't really mind either way. Some may call this junk. Me but everyone in my family treasure. gets called by the surname with their own, like, groups of friends and stuff, so it's it can get really confusing. <laughs> my dad, my son, and me are all referred to as Puck quite a lot of the time. Okay, let's sell some rubbish. Uh, let's sell this hunting bow, the bow of fatigue, and the staff of fury. I feel like I should sell this axe now, but having the soul trap axe is actually pretty useful because I could switch to it. It doesn't weigh a huge amount. I think I won't do that. Uh, sell those. 
I've got so many potions, oh my god. Ingredients. B. Let's eat the B and see what happens. B. Yes, Josh. Josh in the chat is saying that there are a lot of pucky related puns you can do. There certainly are. Most of them to do with ice hockey. Certainly nothing rude. No. Nope. I can't think of any. I bet you've never heard any of them before, ever. Nope, I can't think of a single one. Can I and I can't imagine how anyone would make up something so heinous. Stealing plans. I don't even know where I picked this quest up. Okay, chat. I need some guidance now. I'm at a point where I'm kind of at a crossroads and one of the main reasons for streaming the process was to get guidance from the community. Um, on what, what to do next and stuff. So I've got my werewolf form, I've got my cool sword, uh, I've got a bunch of quests and I don't know what to do next. Apparently Dawn Guard I want to be about level 30, so that's off the table. So let's have a look. Stealing plans, diplomatic immunity, angler acquaintances, dragonborn, in my time of need, or some random trash. Uh, Sam's telling me to go get the full unrelenting force shout, but I actually have it. Focus on shouts, civil war, main quest, as those do not have a level requirement. Okay, alright. I haven't met Parthenax yet. So, to do the civil war, do I have to go and join the Imperials? Uh, excuse me. The hell! What a waste. Yeah, maybe you should bury her and not just. This is not I work cool. With my mother to sell fruits and vegetables. It's fun most days, but hard work. Uh, right. Imperials or Stormcloaks. I know I'm going Imperials already. I don't really like the Stormcloaks. I think they're a bit... They're a bit weird. <laughs> and because I'm an Orc, they, they wouldn't like me either. Because they think that Nords should just be like, basically humans. Uh, right, quest, 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 quest. I guess I'll go join the Imperial Legion. In that case. Sounds good. Let's fast travel to solitude. <laughs> a red coat. I don't want a custom destination, I want a fast travel. Oh, uh, I thought I had. I thought I'd been up there. Let's go to the let's go to the cart man. Yeah, we actually have NordVPN. Josh is, Josh is making jokes about NordVPN, but we actually have it. <laughs> uh, so Sam's telling me I have a level up, so let's do that. I think I will put some stuff into health. And then I might actually put a perk into one-handed fighting now. Okay, armsman, dual flurry. I'm not that interested in. What comes after dual flurry? Dual savagery. Yeah, I'm not going to follow on dual wielding because I want the shield. Fighting stance, critical charge. Can do a one-handed power attack while sprinting that does double critical damage. Uh, standing power attacks do a 25% bonus damage with a chance to decapitate your enemies. Oh yeah, I think I'm going to take that. That's wicked. Oh, someone say Bladesman? I didn't see it till after I'd already selected it. 
whoops it's okay because I can't actually get to it anyway on the on the, on the map thing I, I'm clearly too stupid to get to that perk there we go Bladesman. All right, maybe next time I will take Bladesman because I've got my Dawnbreaker sword now. I can take you to any Come on, Bureau Lamb, let's to go. go to Solitude. Climb yeah, I have been to Solitude. We'll be yeah, the PlayStation controls, it's just a controller, right? So you're just tapping, tapping the D-pad around and hoping oh, for the best. Ah, uh, maybe because I didn't go into Solitude, that's probably why I, um, I couldn't fast travel there. Hello, Solitude you Guard. To Solitude to join the Legion, speak to Ricker. You're just in time. He's a sorry bastard who's going to be executed. A gate guard who let Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city after he killed the High King. Ah, oh, well, that's not his fault, is it? Like, the guy could do, like, dragon shouts and stuff. Let's have a look around up here. There's nothing useful. Yeah, Costa, I did. I, I went straight to Kilcreath to get my cool sword, and I don't regret it one bit. Solitude. Solitude Guard, is that, like, NCR soldier? What's NCR soldier mean, Costa? Positions. As far as you need to go home. Go home and stay there until your mother's done. Ah! Ah! The hell? Reload? Okay. Uh, system. Load. Show all saves. I did something silly there. I interrupted the execution, says Costa. Oh no! <laughs> I, could, I thought they were talking, so I just went up to hear what they were saying, like a bit clearer in my ears. Tell them he didn't do it. Positions. As far as you need to go home. Go home and stay there. Well, I'll just harvest all this nightshade while. Uh... You betrayed us! So is this the guy getting executed? Yeah, right. I didn't realize what it was. I thought it was like a stage or something. <laughs> Let's watch. You helped Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city. Kinda, I just want to use the grindstone, guys. By opening that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed the people of Solitude. He doesn't deserve to speak! There was no murder. Ulfric no. challenged Thorin. He beat the High King in fair combat. Such is our way. Such is the ancient <laughs> custom of King Block saying, imagine you walk into a random courtroom and say hi to the suspect oh. criminal up in his face. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. Uh, if only Alduin would show up for I this guy. Peep peep. Up there. Who's Rodar? Gross. What? Oh, right, okay. <laughs> Sounds. Just, I don't know if you guys can hear Sam in the background of my of my mic. She's like, don't Some do it, don't do it. Guard you are. Feel free to make requests. I'm trying to keep to the chat, but when you uh -huh. stop that these immediate, these immediate actions, uh -huh. I'm going to step in. Okay, I only wanted to do this. Put that down. I think I expect more. Oh, I can't, you can't move the, you can't move the head around. Amulet of Talos. Time between shouts is reduced 20%. Nice. Uh, let's have a look at that. I think I've got a stamina potion otherwise. So the shout thing might actually be better. Uh, 10 points of stamina or Amulet of Talos. I think I'll go with the Amulet of Talos for a bit. He's okay. See how that goes. A little breathy and a little harsh on the nose. I can get the headsman's axe. Speaking of harsh, you bards don't Mind yourself in my city, friend. Oh, uh, maybe I missed it. Swing is a right terrible sight. 
It shouldn't have been like this. How do you save him? Do you save him by talking, or do you just get in there and kill everyone before oh, they can get away? Hounds? You smell like a wet dog. I understand. The winking Don't set foot in solitude until you're really high level, says Sam. Like you could use more. Well, that wasn't going to happen. All right. Let's go find... You're not supposed to be here. I'm not supposed to be. This is the last time I'll say it. Get out. Okay. God. Mood. Moody. Now I remember. You're that new member of the companions. So you what? Fetch the mead? Out with it. Here we go. In this. In this I store. Deal with petty thievery and drug and brawl. If it's arms or armor you need, see Bayrand in Castle Dower. Bloody good blacksmith. Though. I don't abide. Oh, he was he was fussy because I entered after business hours. Got ya. Moody Margaret, I know, right? We've got negative Nancy's, we've got Moody Margaret, it's all sorts. Wanders into the castle. Do you have some reason? She says why are they all girls' names? They're just alliterative. Alright, negative Norman and Moody Michael. There we go. Uh, I believe we've already met General Tullius. I was at Helgen. Right, Helgen. One of the prisoners, if I recall correctly. Correctly, you do recall. I helped Hadvar escape. He said he'd vouch for me. Hadvar's alive. Well, I hope that's true. Of <laughs> course, it says all pissy Pete. <laughs> but he hasn't reported in yet, so he can't exactly confirm <laughs> that's your story. Funny. In the meantime, Costa, you can have an inspiration Jack point for that. I suspect we might have use for someone resourceful like you. Not many survived, Helgen. That Costa, Besides, that one I'm sure you're I don't really know. Maybe we could do something with stream elements to do inspiration points. That's not what my scouts report, sir. Starship has got Every one for some of his jokes. His and you could spend Bruce the inspiration Bronstar point to make me do something. Him. Or make me it's reload a save. It's a rebellion. <laughs> Call it whatever you like, General. The man's going to try to take Whiterun. Jarl Balgruf. Balgruf refuses the Legion's right yeah, to Yeah, Sam says that we need to put something in the Discord for inspiration points. On the other points. hand, he also hmm. refuses to acknowledge Ulfric's claim. Josh, would you well, be able to look into something like that? See if there's a bot that pre-exists. Let Ulfric pillage a That's city. to do with like D&D &D points or something like that. You people and your Maybe we can look at a few different ones. Sir, you can't force a Nord to accept help he hasn't asked for. If Ulfric's making a move for Whiterun, then we need to be there to stop him. Draft another letter with the usual platitudes, but this time share some of your intelligence regarding Ulfric's plans. Quest? Embellish if you have to. Quest? We Quest? let it seem like it's his Quest? idea. Yes, sir. You Nords and your bloody sense of honor. Sir, something to report? All right. Are you ready to be talked to now? There we go. You Legate Ricky. General Tullius told me what happened. Not many made it out alive. I've got a good feeling about you, and I don't often get good feelings about anything. A warrior knows to trust her gut. I'm not going to go through the normal process with you. I've got a little test lined up. Pass that, and we'll talk about you joining the Legion. So Costa says, uh, ah, the Skyrim Civil War conflict. Tradition versus power mongering. Hmm. I can handle anything you throw Is at me. Is that confidence or bravado? Confidence I can use. Bravado gets soldiers killed. We'll soon find out. I'm sending you to clear out Fort Haragstad. If you survive, you'll pass. If you die, then I'll have no further use for your corpse. The ancients built many of them. Sadly, most of them. Fort right. Haragstad. We're going to install a garrison there, but first... So we need to clean out bandits. Clean out the bandits that have moved in. I'm going alone? Consider that fort already Good, yours. that's what I want to hear. Now go make it happen, soldier. Nice. Sir. I hope you don't mind a werewolf doing it. By holding on to Falkreath, we control access to the reach... Now, can I just go get Lydia to help me do this? If I soon, want to. We'll be there to stop it. Watch the skies, traveler.
Uh, my sword is just glowing on my hip. Look. When it's like daytime and stuff, I might have a proper look around Solitude and and see all the shops and things. I think because I've been live streaming as well, I probably haven't been quite as exploratory as I normally would be, like keen to just like go and do things that have a lot of action. So I might have like a session or like an hour long session within a live stream where I just do downtime activities. That might be uh, maybe not the most interesting to watch, but it's part of the game, right? It's kind of part of the fun of it. listening to the music so Costa says it's no longer Dawnbreaker learns for 10 points when killing undead a chance to cause a fiery explosion and so when it's night time it's not Dawnbreaker okay Right, let's have a look on the map. While you guys are debating the finer points of uh, politics and warfare, uh, I'm going to go over to Fort Hragelstad. I guess I'll just do it on my own. I don't think I need a companion. Let's fast travel to Statue of Meridia, and then we'll make our way over from there. Uh, I might wait uh, a few hours though. Like six a.m. is uh, is light light time, isn't it? There we go. Straight over the mountain top. Oh wow! Look, alpine, very alpine. It's gorgeous. So um, I was talking to Josh there uh, a minute ago about maybe looking into putting something in the Discord server to do with points or whatever. Um, earlier today or yesterday, um, Josh installed a Pokemon bot in our Discord server where you can go in, catch a Pokemon, uh, choose your own Pokemon, and as you chat, they level up. Um, it's super fun. I've got a couple. Uh, Sam's got a couple. Starship's got a couple. CMAT's got a couple. Um, some of the other people who aren't in this chat at the moment have got some. It's uh, way more fun than I realised it would be, to be honest. Okay, we're, we're at the fort from the looks of things. I guess I'll quick save here. No. And I actually don't want to turn into a werewolf. I want uh, my... I want my dragon shout. Fostrada. Here we go. This is a <laughs> nice. One, two, kill. One, two, kill. The fire doesn't do huge amounts of damage from the looks of things. Oh, I'm down. Oh, I was looking at their health, not mine. This <laughs> one needs something. So King says the correct political stance in Skyrim is moving into a cave to become a mushroom cottage core hermit. Yeah, yeah, I think I I can I can get with that. Right, let's uh, be a bit more strategic about this. Let's kill one. Set as many people on fire as possible. Power attack. Kill. Run away. Put you on fire. Stun, stun. Oh, his head's off. Ah, oh, did you see that? <laughs> Brutal. <laughs> That's a bit better. I really want to get the perk where I can block arrows with my shield, thinking about it. 
gold sapphire ring, nice. Well, this weapon is absolutely solid. Archery! Yeah, I need to run away and heal. Still healing. Okay. Dawnbreaker. Farmer shield, there we go. Oh, I can't wait to put Dawnbreaker on my next thumbnail. On <laughs> my next stream. Stand it, Thug. Highway man is clearly not a man. You are a lady. Down you go. All right, cool. So, King, yeah, what happened is we went to get Dawnbreaker. Excuse me, drinking water. Um, we went to get Dawnbreaker because I was going in a random mine that uh, Costa guided me to. And then I opened a chest and this like sort of polyhedral sphere was in there called like the beacon. And then there was this voice that came from nowhere. And then we went and did the dungeon there. That dungeon wasn't actually as hard as one of the earlier ones. but um, And then we got the Dawnbreaker sword, which I'm going to use to kill vampires later on. Uh, I also see that you're talking about the you know, health effects of mushrooms. I don't know much about that. I don't think I'm part of that conversation. The mycologist, however, is a character in Inscription, uh, which I, I'm actually, I have an Inscription game paused on the mycologist right now. And he's about to do something weird to me. I can't remember exactly what it is he does. Excuse me. I can do better than this. But I'm about to die. So let's. Uh... Hmm. <laughs> uh, I'm in danger. Oh. <laughs> I didn't quick save. I didn't quick save for all of that, I don't think. No. Yeah, I got the yeah king. I got the new hand touch, touches the beacon thing. Right, we're going to redo this whole flipping area because I was uh, time to get lost, distracted. Can I only go into werewolf form at night? Okay. I think I've just got nothing selected at the moment. Yeah, why why are my shouts not working? Why is my shout not working? Uh, shouts, unrelenting force. There we go. Right, let's do you one at a time. Kill you. Heal. These guys seem a bit tougher than some of the other enemies I've been fighting. Are they just are they just leveled up with me sort of thing? And up, well, down you go. You're a toughie. You've got heavy armor. Cut your head off. <laughs> okay, let's quick save there. Go. 
and get my dragon shout back. Oh yeah, so they are they are kind of uh, leveling with me. Yeah, I thought they might be. Uh, let's quick save there and then pause. I'm just going to go for a quick comfort break, and I'll be back in about one minute. Wow, we have some philosophy in the chat. Costa says, Ah, but the lips of wisdom are always sealed except to the ears of the understanding, Adam. Well, you're not wrong. But there are some caveats in that sentence that would exclude me, I feel. Bang! Ah, down you go, son. Oh, that was a lady. Sorry. Down you go, daughter. Right, got a quick save here. It's good a quick save after every enemy. How about a uh, full slow This uh, person's got quite a lot of health. I just picked up some. Just picked up the wrong thing. Uh, what's it? Some crappy armor? No, I didn't. Cool. Uh, let's heal again. Yeah, I'm glad that you made me put some points into restoration because I seem to be using the healing a lot. All right, let's get in and get these two. One up the top of that tower. Might take them out first. I'll rip your heart out. I thought they said I'll rip your heart off. Power attack. He said mercy a little bit too late there. Alright, let's go take care of the other one. A lot of flipping archers on these walls. Shield bash. Power attack. No stamina. It's nothing. Cool. He's dead. Yeah, Sam says, uh, I know you didn't want to use any magic, but healing is really useful. It, I'm getting the sense already, because I was thinking about Skyrim all day today, <laughs> while I was like going out for a walk and stuff. I'm getting the sense already that you just generally end up with lots of different stats, doing lots of different things. Uh, healing is so obviously good that why would you why would you not use it? There's just I feel like there's not enough. Wet, I feel like it's not possible to get enough potions to not use the healing spell, actually. And I have made a lot of potions. Okay, here's a door. All right, let's get in there and clear it out. Just 
swamp him in there. Okay, I went. I, I died there. I actually didn't spot the other yeah. guy behind me. Maybe I should uh, actually go and get a. Uh... <laughs> Because the game is kind of designed with companions in mind, right? Like, you're supposed to have someone there as a meat shield. Stun! Ah, oh, yeah, I'm dead. What do you want? Hmm. Yes? Yeah, I think we need to go get Lydia. King says uh, you should look into food like soups and stews. They're underrated. Oh, I don't want to be in here. Yeah, the chat is telling me to go get Lydia. Lydia! It's like that meme that you were talking about, Sam, of Taika Waititi showing uh, Kate Blanchett his drawings or whatever. I'm going to go get Lydia. Where the hell is it? Oh, here we go. Lydia, we need you to help us defeat the Imperials. Hey now, you be careful with that fire. Put it that way. Right, she's usually sitting up at this table up here. Some big nasty what bandits need, hurt us. Come and help. Honor to you. Lead the way. Costa confessed earlier in the in the uh, stream that uh, Lydia is his uh, digital crush of choice, and I think that's fair. He's very capable. Right, we're going back over here. King says, same, <laughs> your digital crush of choice. Uh, Sam, when you say you need to go get the Breeze home house, what does that mean? Right, Liddy, we're gonna go in and fight these nasty people. Where's my, where's my familiar? Right, man, it's right. Uh, yeah, they've got a lot of help. Ah, oh, what? This better be good. Why am I struggling with these fights so much? What am I doing wrong? You picked a bad time to get lost, friend. Is the fire hurting me? Is my own fire hurting me? There we go. Oh, it's two heavy weapon people. That's why. Right, okay. Fair. That is fair. Focus on the guys that are wielding two handed weapons. Okay, alright. I think the familiar is actually no use. I'm gonna have to. I think I'll immediately turn around, uh, re-equip my shield. Now ain't this a surprise? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going out here, mate. You stay there. Oh yeah, use my dragon shout. You'd think I would remember that, considering I was using it like three minutes ago. All right. 
Let's do this. This guy I'll just do normal fighting. And then when the big guys come in, we'll do full stuff. Kill you. Right, he's off the table. Did I just... Oh, I just got one-shotted. Okay. Shout and Dan just dumped your stamina into killing me. I'm actually stuck behind Lydia here. Right, that's one of them dead. <laughs> Just escape out here and heal up. Okay, so need to perk some more combat skills, yeah, maybe, and uh, and upgrade armor. I see what you're saying, yeah. Uh, let's equip the farmer shield. I've got my shout back. I could use my berserker skill, but I feel like I'm just going to double down on shout. Why are you hanging around in the corner, little wallflower? Highway man. Right, he's dead. Nice. Go out here, save again. So only 30 smithing skill to get the dwarven armor, uh, says the chat. Uh, I might be there nearly. Yeah, maybe I just need to like go and spam some smithing. Do you think? Could be the way forward. All right, let's let's throw it up. Oh, Lydia! Oh no. Lydia, you... I didn't mean to do that to you. There we go. That was easily done after that. I'll have this potion, please. Alright, well, with your help, I got there. But yeah, I definitely think I need to buff up some fighting now. Craft a bunch of daggers, eh? Alright. There's another door here. I'm just going to hang around and let my dragon shout re refresh. So King says you can crank up smithing by crafting some leather armour, keeping the exploits out, of course, just as a blacksmith would. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I feel like just what if you've got that? a few levels to just bump up, it's slightly different. That's more like grinding. It's not like an exploit, is it? Yeah, he's there. Is that the main guy? Oh, oh, there was a, oh, there was a hammer. There's an axe man behind me. This is the most I've died. Huh? Just this, like these weird bandits. I think they've got heavy weapons. Okay, all right. Good stuff. Anything on here? No, all trash. What's this? A coin purse. Car hold. All right, we'll uh, we'll just heal up quickly. Found my shields. Quick save. Let's go. Now you're mine. Oh, look, an egg. Hey, I was looking at an egg. Be mine.
Lydia, sort it out. Sort it out, love. There we go. Oh, oh she got the kill. She earned that kill. That was her kill, I would say. Uh, completed. Clear out Fort uh, Hagarstad, whatever it was. Retort, report to Legate Ricker. Will do. Anything good in here? No. 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 This is all just bread. Brief history of the Empire. I was hoping that was going to be a um, a buff. All right, Lydia, let's get out of here and let's go back and talk to the Empire. All right. Cheese for everyone. Do you want me to go back and get the cheese? I'll do it. There we go. There. It's not too much trouble. Uh, apparently it is. I can't find my way around. I could, uh, there's a, I could like find a space and just go dump cheese in that space and fill it. I could give it to those dead cultists that are just lying in the middle of Whiterun forever. Oh, I see. Yeah, well, I, I think almost every single meme about Skyrim is going to be lost on me. Uh, the cheese thing is a meme. I'm sorry, but ha but you you can teach me. I can learn through this process. All right. Oh, we want to go back to solitude, actually. Yeah. Here we go. Fast travel to solitude. Yes, please. Oh, there's a chest. All right. Back we go. <laughs> I didn't see the chest. Right, let's, let's charge in there. There's like one dude up there. Oh, the Imperials are in. Hello. Yes. I'm here. I'm here to loot a chest that you now technically own. You're in trespassing Imperial. here. You better clear out. Are you joking me? I'm the one who. This is your last warning. Get. How ungrateful. Fine. I'll come back when I'm a member of the Empire. A bunch of idiots. Can you believe that? Typical Imperial bureau bureaucracy. <laughs> hey, watch it! You might want to rethink that. Are they reforming the Dawn Guard? True. I may look the part of dashing swordsman. A lot of people are telling me their life stories right now. Let's go I'm to Castle Dower. Talk to uh, Ricky. Tell me again why you can set off that junk at bits and pieces. All right, Ricky. I've cleaned out that thing. Right thing. I got killed a lot. Welcome back, soldier. I'm glad you made it in one piece. I'll send men to garrison the fort right away. You did well. I'm impressed. But before we go any further, it's time for you to officially join the Legion. Speak with General Tullius. I should think it is my time to officially join you. the Legion. I just soloed that entire the fort for you. You'll be taking an oath by well, me and Lydia. The service of the Emperor, and thus to every citizen of the Empire. Controlling the pit changed your mind. Decided you wanted a soldier for the Empire after all. I'm ready to take the oath. Well then, repeat after me. Upon my honor, I do swear undying loyalty to the Emperor. Oh, you posted the cheese meme in general uh, on Discord? <laughs> and unwavering obedience to the officers of Hid. May those above judge me. Long I'm speedrunning this Emperor. oath. Welcome. Just, Just give me the quests. We speak to Baron. Now, if I'm not mistaken, Legate Ricca has a special assignment for you. So tell me again why I'm wasting men chasing after a fairy tale. All right, if come on, Ricker, what are we doing? Welcome to the Legion, Auxiliary. Listen up. Traditions. I thought the Moot chose the king. We're backing Elisif. When the Moot meets... Welcome to the Legion, Auxiliary. Listen up. Ulfric's right-hand man, 
Galmar, Galmar Stonefist, Stonefist has located what he believes is the final resting place of the Jagged Crown. We're going to make sure he doesn't get his hands on it. The rest of my men are already assembling outside Corvinjun. I'll meet you there as soon as I finish up here. All right, so we've got a new mission. I think that'll be the one that I, uh, I go and do. Um, You've been here long enough to know that Nords aren't always sensible. We follow our hearts. Let's have a look in my inventory quickly. See what trash I've picked up again. No, I'm, I'm doing all right actually. Do I have so a level up? That's the question. No, and I have no perks. So for smithing. So for smithing, do I want to look at getting arcane blacksmith so I can improve magical weapons and armor? Or do I want to go for dwarven smithing? Uh, create dwarven armor and weapons at forges, yeah. Sam's desperately Alfred trying to find the, um, <laughs> the cheese meme, the Skyrim no, cheese meme. Not as simple as that, but the jagged crown would be a potent symbol for his Oh, okay, right. But I don't abide fancy clothes, but you look like you might. I hear Radiant Raymond Okay, of course it's telling me to do Dwarven first and then Arcane. Well, I think what I may do, actually, I'd quite like to use this opportunity, if you, if none of you mind, to have a little look around Solitude. So I might uh, just wait uh, the entire night. <laughs> just stand out here all night. And I want to go and see like what the shops are and all that kind of stuff. This will be like my new base. We've moved on from Whiterun for a short time. So, uh, what are some good places to visit in Solitude? I'm guessing there's an inn, there's a shop. Hmm? Sorry, I was lost in thought. Some say I got my position because my cousin is the Emperor. Nonsense. <laughs> She's the talking about her wedding, nothing. okay. He can't even be bothered to attend uh, my wedding. Vittoria Vici's house. Proud Spire Manor. That looks exciting. You stay out of trouble now. Oh, Dr. Cast Psychotic, you've been lurking in the chat. How long have you been here for? How you doing? Uh, for anyone who's interested, Dr. Psychotic is a member of my Discord server and a very good content creator himself. Um, I liked your portal videos. It was quite, it was quite cool. Uh, if you're in our Discord server, you can find his content um, showing up in our community content thing. I've just glitched out my map. Here we go. There we go. I wanted to search barrel. I kept accidentally going to the map. All right. I feel like I'm not finding the shops here. Advar's house. Who's Advar? I feel like I, I recognise that name. Trouble. What can I do for you? Pardon me. Need something? No, that's Hadvar. This is Advar. I'm just gonna walk around his house. Let's uh let's unequip all quests. Nice. Although I did just see one that looks pretty good. Uh, get Imperial gear from Berand. Okay, let's do that. Maybe that'll take us around Solitude. Uh, so, Doctor, I've never referred to you by voice. Do you go like? Do you prefer to go with Doctor, Psychotic, Psycho? Uh, what's your preferred moniker for being referred to by voice? I understand you're at work. If you have to dash off, that's fine. Jala's house. Right, let's follow the. I go where the marker takes me. Has anyone seen that episode of Rick and Morty? I really liked that one. I thought it was quite funny. With a very dystopian joke at the end. Talk to the guy with the cap behind you. Okay, down the hill. This guy. Hello. You, you help me. You help I thought me, he right? was wearing goggles. That's what you do. Please take pity on an old madman. Take pity on an old madman. Here, have. Oh, what do you need? 
My master has abandoned me, abandoned his people, and nothing I say can change his mind. Now he refuses to even see me. He says I interrupt his vacation. It's been so, so many, many years. years. Won't you please help? Won't you please help? Oh, uh, doctor. I'm going to have to call you the doctor, man. That's it. Also, what is... Uh, is Abby as in... Oh, no. Have I got your gender right? Sorry. I've been getting people's gender wrong loads. Uh, okay. Why don't you leave your master? Oh, you just don't understand. Without him, I am not free. Without him, I am doomed. All of his empire shall fall into chaos. Dr. Abbey. Last I saw him, he was visiting a friend in the Blue Palace. But no one as mundane as a Jarl. No, no. Such people are below him. No, he went into the forbidden wing of the palace to speak. Oh, and you'll need the hip bone. It's oh man, important. I didn't know. You no, can't tell people's gender <laughs> with like with photos on Discord. Oh, you just don't okay. understand. Without him, I am not free. Without him, I am doomed. All of his empire shall fall into chaos. Okay, let's uh, go see what's going on with that then. If you're heading to the Blue Palace, you might want to rethink that. So, did I pick up a quest from him then? The Mind of Madness. Devenin wants me to talk to his master about uh, returning from vacation. To do so, I need to gain entrance to the Pelagius Wing of the Blue Palace. Okay, I think we might do that. We might do that. That's pretty fun. I want to get this Imperial gear from Behran, so I'm going to just go grab it. Uh, where is he up there? I guess he's working, like, outside. I guess I don't have to wear it, though, because I've probably got better armor than they can give me. That's what I started with. Hello, Bayrand. Seems there's no end to the needs of the Imperials. But what can I General help Tullius you? said you get me outfitted. Yep. Light, medium, heavy. They don't make finer steel. Now that's it. One free outfit per soldier. You lose that or get it banged up. You. I think I would. Oh. You okay. Think storm cloaks and I've got my kit. Are dangerous. I'm now over encumbered. Lydia, I need you to carry all my stuff. I've got your back. Uh, I need to trace some things. How can with I you. serve you, my thane? Let's give her all that imperial crap I just picked up. Give, 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 give. All right. Lead, I'll follow. Need arms or armor. I'll get that back off her when I need it. Make her equip the gear you've got. Did, shall I make her equip my gear and then um, I'll wear the Imperial gear? Is that what you're saying? I've got your back. How can I serve you, my Thane? I'll wear all the Imperial trash. And then go over to her and equip stuff on her. She's wearing all my stuff. Oh, just have her wear the Imperial kit. <laughs> I don't know. I know. I know it's trash, but I might wear this for a little while while I'm going around to do Imperial business and maybe change it. 
maybe change it, change it later. It's funny how my breastplate turns into boob armor. Some fine imperial armor you've got there. That's right, man. Uh, if only Solitude Guard was in the chat today. This is his. This is his time. Right, quests. Quest, quest. Mind of Madness. <laughs> Costa is upset that I'm wearing the Imperial stuff because it's a considerable downgrade from what I had. All right then, look. Here we go. Lydia, come in. Come in. We're going to do Still a clothes here. swap. Uh, I, I need to trade some things with I you. I am sworn to carry your burdens. Let's take all her stuff. So she still has her like that's her like Lead default on. armor. I've got your back. I am sworn to carry your burdens. <laughs> She's so funny, right? Give, 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 give. I I'm just I know I'm just in my pants. <laughs> I am at your command. And let's put my stuff back on. Boink, boink. Where's my Falmer shield? There it is. Lead All right. On. Sorted. Hey, want to play tag? Pardon me. I don't want to play tag. So let's go and have a look at this little side quest here thing. With Derver in. Unless we have specific business, I'm not interested. I wouldn't mind buying a house here in Solitude. It seems quite nice. They look like they've got a good uh, handle on damp control. The Blue Palace discovered. Hey, buddy. I have to wonder. What does the Dragonborn do once he's been summoned by the Greybeards? Can the Thune be taught? Like any skill? Uh, let's run in here and see what's up. See what's what. She's not wearing the Imperial stuff. Uh... I've got your back. I am sworn to carry <laughs> your burdens. Okay. Equip. No. Oh. Give. Uh, how do I make her equip stuff? She won't equip it if it's worse than her gear. I see. Okay. Understood. 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 You did say that earlier, but I didn't actually fully understand what you meant. So that's why she's only put the helmet on, because the helmet was better than having no helmet. I gotcha. I gotcha. I gotcha. So Sam's saying that I need a non-armor outfit, like a like a, a fancy outfit to wear, to go to like palaces and stuff. And I, And I get that. I think that's important. I don't know where to get one. Folk Firebeard. Imagine if you had red hair and people called you Firebeard. Please, don't interrupt the court. We need someone to investigate. Then we will immediately send out a legion to scour the cave and secure the town. Hafengar's people will always be safe under my rule. My scrying has suggested nothing in the area. Dragonbridge is under Imperial control. This is likely superstitious nonsense. Okay. Perhaps a more tempered reaction might be called for. Oh, yes, of course, you were right. Falk, tell Captain Aldous I said to assign a There's a lot of people talking here. Dragonbridge. Thank you, Jarl Elisif. What about the cave? I will have someone take care of the cave as well, Varnius. And rest easy. You're dismissed. Got lots of things to take I care of. I need to get into the Pelagius well, Not wing. in your life. It's dangerous in there, and Falk doesn't even... If you really want to, just be careful of the ghost. He snuck up on me once and scared me sick. It took a week for me to feel better. Okay. 
So I've got a blue key. I've got what I came for. I better get back to Dragon Bridge. Let's drop a quick save here. If this is a, if this is actually some deadly ghost. <laughs> King says Noth Pike doesn't understand personal space. Immersive. The tailor gives me a quest that comes with fine clothes. Says uh, Abby. All right. Just loot it off people. All right. Okay. So I can loot it. I can buy it. I can do a quest to get it. Right now, we'll keep the armor on. Okay, so there's a ghost in here, maybe? Lydia, don't sneak up on me like that. You made me jump. Uh, this is all just mead and stuff, yeah. There's going to be spiders in here. Ghosty! What the hell? What the hell? Pelagius the Mad. Naysayers, buffoons, detractors. Why, my, my headsman hasn't slept in three days. You are far too hard on yourself, my dear, sweet, homicidally insane Pelagius. What would the people Careful. do without you? Dance, sing, smile, <laughs> grow old. You are the best septum that's ever ruled. Well, except for that part. Okay, what's going but on he here? turned into a dragon god, and that's hardly sporty. You know, I was there for that whole sordid affair. Marvelous time, but her needs wow, something like blood, people. a fox, a severed head. <laughs> that's oh, busy. And the cheese. Talk to Shiogarath. Is that an elephant's trunk? Yes, oh, mammoth yes, snout. Okay. Said, How rude. Whoa. Can't be bothered to host an old friend for a decade or two. Where are we? Inside the mind of Pelagius, silly. Oh, is it your first time? Who were you talking Pelagius to? Pelagius the third. Now, surely even you know about Pelagius's decree on his deathbed. Oh, and this was inspired. He forbade death. That's right. <laughs> death outlawed. I'm here to deliver a message. Really? Oh, oh what kind of message? A song. A summons. <laughs> Everyone in the chat is loving this. I don't know what's going on. Death threat written on the back of an Argonian concubine. Ah, those are my favorites. Well, spit it out, mortal. I haven't got an eternity. Actually, I do. Little joke. But seriously, what's the message? Uh, shall I say, I think I made a mistake coming here. Or I was asked to retrieve you from your vacation. I like his outfit. He might be mad, but he's certainly got some... Uh, Got some thread style. Um, I'm going to go with I was asked to retrieve you from your vacation. Were you now? By whom? Wait! Don't tell me. <laughs> I want to guess. Right. Was it Molag? No, no. Little Tim. The toy oh, in Wonderland son, now, ah. apparently, oh. says Costa. The ghost of King Lysandus? Ah, oh, or was it one? Yes! Stanley, the talking grapefruit from Passwall! Ha <laughs> ha! I'm wrong on all accounts, aren't I? Ha! <laughs> no matter! Honestly, I don't want to know. Why ruin the surprise? But more to the point, do you, tiny, puny, expendable little mortal, actually think you can convince me to leave? Because that's crazy! <laughs> you do realize who you're dealing with here? Uh, you're a madman. Uh, what should I say to him? I'm afraid I don't know, sir. All I know is that your people need you to return, or you're a madman. Uh, I'm gonna, actually going to go with this one, because we did speak to Deverin. Dev uh, uh, oh, pardon <laughs> me. What are you saying, something? 
I do apologize. Okay, he's bored. I mean, really. Here he is. The Daedric Prince of Madness. Gorath himself, Daedric Prince of Madness. Okay. And all you deem fit to do is he going to make me do stuff? <laughs> make me like muck about chasing bunnies. So apparently, uh, Shigarath, in the law, he's the most powerful of Daedra. All the other gods and deities are scared of him, so they end up cursing him as part of a cruel joke. Uh, forever making him mad. Take it from a madman, he knows. Now that's the real question, isn't it? Because honestly, how much time off could a demented Daedra really need? So, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to leave. That's right, I'm done. Holiday complete! Time to return to the humdrum day to day. On one condition. You have to find the way out first. Well, good luck with that. Okay, what's the cat? Ha! I do love it when the mortals know they're being manipulated. Makes things infinitely more interesting. Care to take a look around? This is not, I dare say, the Solitude Botanical Gardens. Have you any idea where you are? Where you truly are? I do not. Welcome to the deceptively verdant mind of the Emperor Pelagius the Third. That's right! You're in the head of a dead, homicidally insane monarch! <laughs> Now, I know what you're thinking. Can I still rely on my swords and spells and sneaking and all that nonsense? Sure. Sure. Or you could use... The Wabajack! The Wabajack. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Didn't see that coming, did you? <laughs> Completed. Search for Der Vernon's master in the Pelagius wing. Use the Wabajack to hey, escape man. from Pelagius. I'm busy mind. doing the fish stick. It's a very delicate state of mind. Okay, so I've got this. Now, I've actually heard of the Wabberjack. Sam's talked about it, and I've seen it. I've heard it talked about, like, on Spiffing Brit videos, but I haven't actually seen it. I don't know what it does. I guess it's just like a magic staff, like a power, a power staff thing. Okay, yeah, so it, like, just blasts people. Let's go. I got me a Wabberjack. You've headed down the path of dreams. Unfortunately for you, Pelagius suffered night terrors from a young age. All what? you need to do is find something to wake our poor Pelagius up. You'll find his terrors easy to repel, but persistent. Find something to wake him up. Can't talk to him. Uh... Oh, look, a butterfly. No, I can't shoot a butterfly. Can I shoot him? Oh, a wolf. Ah, uh... Bro. Oh. Hello. Uh, well, so far it's turned a wolf into a sheep. Is that gonna? Is that gonna work? you up. <laughs> Sam says she think I like the Wabberjack. I mean, it's... I can't turn that sheep into anything. Can we shoot him? Ah! Time to get lost, ah. <laughs> what are you? Little Pelagius? Yes. Hello. Are you going to wake yourself up? Hi there. Ag Raven. Who 
are you? Sultry Maiden. Try asking him to kindly wake up. Oh! <laughs> Clever. Uh, flame axe and axe. What did you turn into? Nothing. A fire. Oh, you turned into a fire. Wake up. Um. Oh, so I think I have to reset the whole thing. Right, don't punch him. Right, so it's the sheep. Child. Don't kill the sheep, idiot. Uh, it's the Hag Raven Salt Tree Major. Hey! I shot you. Uh, and then it was uh, the flame axe with the fire. Where have you come from? Cool, and then. Dragon priest, hell! Well, Flipping now it. that's something to crow about. With Pelagius up and about, you're moving right along. All right. We'll both be home in no time. I'm all ears. <laughs> Hello, Thrak. Thanks for joining. So uh, we are doing uh, like a side quest we picked up in Solitude, where I've got a magic stick that transforms things. I'm all ears. And it is midnight here. It's not that late. It's not too bad. I'm all ears. So have I completed that? I think I've Need done something? this. Yeah, let's go. All right, good job. <laughs> Costa, it's 2 a.m. What happens if I shoot Sheergarath with the Wabberjack? Um, to anyone watching, uh, my friend Thrak is um, a fellow streamer, much more experienced than me, and kind of like an unofficial mentor when I got approached by a developer to cover a game called Suck Up, um, which is like an AI chat power game, and I didn't really know what I was doing talking to the developers, Thrak kind of stepped in and gave me a bit of guidance. Um, his content's really good, and uh, you can find him in the Discord. I don't think I've got. I don't think I've got our community content thing to pull your streams in, so I'll change that. Can be seen here fully. Here we go. Uh, I don't know. The self-loathing enhances Pelagius's anger. Ah, but his confidence will shrink. You must bring the two into balance. Wonderfully done. Oh my dear. Oh, I think I've done it. ready to love himself. And continue hating everyone else. <laughs> <laughs> Traxus didn't uh, come here to get plugged. Came here to call you bad at Skyrim. Yeah, sorry, I I missed a guy because I was chatting away like an idiot. I missed the tiny orc. I do rewatch my own streams, so I'll probably catch it. Catch it tomorrow. Okay, next path. Oh, good choice! Oh, I'll tell you what, you know what, actually. I'm going to reload. Because I feel bad that I missed the tiny orc because I was chatting away. Let's go back in there. And this time I will, I'll look at the tiny ah. orc. Now this is a sad path. Tiny York, tiny Pelagius York. hated and feared many things. Assassins, wild dogs, the undead. Pumper oh, now I see it. But the, the deepest, Lord. keenest hatred was for himself. The hey, buddy. Can be seen here fully. They're always carried out on the weakest part of his practice. <sighs> the self-loathing enhances Pelagius' yes, anger. You. Ah, but... His confidence will shrink with every day. You must bring the two into balance. Oh. 
Wonderfully done. Linus is finally ready to love himself. We are fixing someone's dementia with the Wabajack. Yes. I think we've done it. Nice. There we go. Tiny Pelagius. He did kind of look like an orc from a distance. I'm going to wave my wab stick at someone. Right. Next path. Here we go. Wab stick, wab stick. Oh, uh, good choice. Yeah, Costa, I understand well, that you'll be going me. in a while if I it's 2 o'clock in the morning. That's pretty late. So terribly entertaining. Oh. <laughs> you <laughs> might find it. Less so. You see, do you even Wabstick, bro? Thrack. Let us say Thrack in the chat says that Wabstick sounds like oh, a no, felony. We don't have felonies in the UK. We don't have law. We don't need it. We're all just terribly civilized. That woman wielded fear like a cleaver. What would she do with a cleaver and make people afraid? You had more right. Oh, but she taught her son well. Pelagius learned at a very early age that King could come from anywhere, at any time, delivered! Oh, I thought you'd never figure it out! With the threat gone, Pelagius is under the illusion that he's safe, which means you've helped him out, sir. And we're that much closer to well, home. Well, I didn't think I... I didn't really solve the puzzle there, I just shot the wab stick at everyone. <laughs> so Thrax says that uh, someone referred to something as jiffy smogging and jiffy smogging sounds like a British crime it certainly does yeah an English crime at least certainly the sort of crime that somebody that's, that sounds like me would uh, I'm busy doing the would fish commit it's that and you know delicate state of mind. I fixed Pelagius's mind with my wab stick fixed is such a subjective term I think treated is far more appropriate, don't you? Like one does to a rash, or an arrow in the face. Ah, but no matter. Heartless mortal that you are, you've actually I just kind of want to let him talk. survived! I am first to honor my end of the bargain. So, congratulations! You're <laughs> free to go. Frack says, I I'll fucking jiffy smog you, mate. Take so, your own back, blood. Go. Oh, uh, really? wrong, uh, wrong accent. Proud to be rash, innit? The way that you said that sounded scouse. Hmm. Th Pelagius Septum the Third. Once the mad emperor okay, can of I, can I go? You said I can so go. So boringly sane. I always knew he had it in him. Well, oh, did I, I miss the last hmm. bit of the dialogue? Yeah, maybe. So I have been known to change my mind. So hmm. Nah. So I have been known to change my okay. mind. So. Let's make sure I'm not forgetting anything. How Close. do I go? Check. Luggage. Luggage. Now where did I leave my luggage? Ah, there we go. Master, you've taken me back. Does this mean we're going home? Oh, happy times. I can't wait to... Yes, yes, that's quite enough celebration. Let's send you ahead, shall we? As for you, a little mortal minion. Feel Yay, free wab to stick. Keep the wabba jack. As a symbol of my I'll just take the damn thing. You take care of yourself now. And if you ever find yourself up in New Sheo, do look me up. We can share a strawberry tart. Ha <laughs> ta ta So Thrak, um so I used to Oh <laughs> I used to know this person, I can't remember their name now, I think it's Emily, who uh, was French but could do speak French in a Scouse accent. It was the weirdest thing. It'd be like, uh, sort of like, yo, uh, it'd be like, oui, bonjour, je m'appelle Emily, but obviously really good. Not bad like mine. Uh, down in the cellar. Is this the way I came in? I think, I think it's not. Ah. Lydia made me jump then. I thought she was a ghost. Here we go. Back out the way we came. Is 
Is this the way? Right, oh, I think I just better equip a quick quest and that'll. Uh, let's go for the jagged crown. Ah, there's the door. <laughs> Huh? Yes, uh, Thrak. Uh, French Scouse is, is, is pretty strange. Oh, pretty strange sound. Just tidying up. All right, we've solved that problem. We've got a wab stick. Uh, I think this is probably the right time to wrap up the stream, to be honest. Oh. Let's put our fifth. Yeah, Lydia. Oh, I know. Lydia's upset. We've got our nightcap on. We've got our. I don't know. What is that? Like a bathrobe sort of thing? We've got the wab stick. Let's get that out and equip that. There it is. Um, so yeah, well, um, everyone who's joined and stayed up super late and given me guidance on Skyrim, including Samantha, who's sat next to me, um, thank you so much. If there's anyone watching who isn't already like subscribed or what have you, um, please feel free to do so. We've also got a Discord server that you can jump in on, and we're having lots of fun catching Pokemon in the Discord server at the moment. Um, you'll find a link to that on the front page of the channel. Um, and if you're watching on Catch Up and you like four and a half hour five hour uh, Skyrim streams then um, leave us a like or whatever and, and stick around to see, see if you enjoy the next one um, uh, you've all been fabulous I've been Adam Pucky have a wonderful day or two o'clock in the morning or evening or whatever it is and I will catch you next time bye